What's going on everybody? How are you? How are you? How are you? Glad you could all make it. Glad you're all here. Glad you're all here. So, how's it going? How's it going? I guess uh, you guys are ready to play some Jackbox games tonight because I am. I am. I want to play a little bit of Joke Boat. Oh man, it's going to be a good night. It's going to be a great night. How's everybody doing? Where's my mouse at? There's my mouse at. Eh. Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. That's not what I wanted to do. There we go. So yeah, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Girl fan bam in the house. My name's Sean. This is Backseat Girl Productions, and uh, yeah, we're here to play some games, play uh, some Jackbox games. Uh, it's gonna be an a uh, un uh, bleh, bleh, can't talk uncensored game night, pretty much for the most part. We'll get into the details in a second, y'all. But uh, we gotta thank the Psycho Ducky, thanking the Psycho Ducky for. You know, I mean, what did he say? Was that a sticker? What was that thing? That was a super chat. It said, Ring-a-ding-ding, -ding, Vegemite! Oh, Psycho Ducky, thank you so much. So very much. Let's, uh, get back over here. We'll, we'll thank everybody on the super chat board right now. Mrs. Amanda, Carson's <coughs> Carson Claus, Howard Matlock, the Psycho Ducky. Gosh, all those check marks. Goodness gracious. Sun City Scratchers, the V3, Deadpool, Rhino Scratches, Fantastic Wit. You are awesome. Ah, uh, Sarah and T with Mrs. B is in the room. What's going on, Mrs. B? I really need to adjust this. Yeah, that's a little bit better. That's a little bit better. Not 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 great, but yeah, it works for now anyway. So guys. <laughs> Mic check one, two. Woo! That was good. That was a good one. I like it. I like it. So let me see here. Let me pause that. Let me get over there. Alright, guys, so. Hmm, what all are we gonna do tonight? We're gonna play a little bit of Joke Boat. I think we're gonna start off uh, with Joke Boat first. My phone is making crazy noises. Why is my phone making crazy noises? Toasty! Toasty! Who was that? Who was that? One hell of a mic check. Thank you. That's right, guys. Uh, pretty much the uh, the censorship is off tonight. We're not gonna drop any F bombs, but other than that, I don't really care what y'all say. <laughs> hey, there's a good one. Uh, YouTube, but uh, really, I don't know. Hold on a second. I think the joke boat is going to be rocking this <laughs> evening from B-Claw Brood. Oh my gosh, the B-Claw Brood. Thank you so much, Beth. Let me get you on the board, my friend. It, uh, it, uh, huh, huh. <laughs> we got a new segment of the night, too. I would love to just show you uh, my new segment. Uh, you want 10K, and it's trivia time. Uh-oh, Lee Chan Lee's in the room. He is going to play some trivia in the chat. You're going to want to check that out. It's uh, interspersed with uh, BGP questions and Lee Chan Lee fan questions. Uh, the only real way to know. <laughs> Stroflex! What is up, Stroflex? I'm glad to see you in the room, dude. Did you officially... No, he didn't officially change it. Hello, Tom Andrews. How are you, sir? How are you, sir? Joe Arcade wins all the way in, on, in from the UK. Golly, we got a an all-star cast here of characters all over the age of 13. Damn it. All of you are over the age of 13, and if you're not, you're not allowed to be here, guys. I'm so sorry. 
It's been a fun run if you are under the age of 13, but uh, not anymore, guys. Uh, so, that being said, here we go. Uh, we're keeping Stro time, but we might do some Stro Flex merch. Stro Flex. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Sun City's in the room. Cammy back is in. Cammy back. Cammy Blue on the moves in the room. Flo Beck's in here. B Club Brew. Oh my goodness, Stephanie Ellis. Joe Arcade wins. Uh, I can't get the thing off my screen. There it goes. There it goes. Uh, Joe Arcade wins. Lee Chan Lee, of course. Uh, of course, we got Scuba Man James Gerhardt's in here. B Claw Brew. Taro and T with Mrs. B. Nice to see you again. Tom Andrews in here. Nice to see you as well, sir. Uh, Arcade Arcade. I see you're in the room as well. And of course, Psycho Ducky, like all the time. Oh my goodness. You guys are so amazing. Give it up for yourselves. Give it up for yourselves. You all deserve it, y'all. You all deserve it. You are great. We got games. We got new segments. Uh, right now, let's see. What is this? Uh, crap, I'm mentally the age of three. Well, I don't care how old you are mentally. Mentally, you can be however age you want to be, but your old driver's license or, or birth certificate needs to say that you're over the age of 13 to play the game. And, uh, you know, that's that's okay. Um, you know, I, I'm sorry, but uh, I know you guys uh, are gonna do what you do. Um, let's see. If you say the f bomb, uh, you may be timed out. Yeah, that's that's true. That's true. Um, we're we're not gonna allow the f bombs. Uh, you know, just willy nilly. You know, like if we're playing a rap battle or something like that, then we might start getting into that kind of territory. But uh, as far as just you know everyday conversation, we can talk civilly to one another without having to drop f bombs every now and then. But you know, shit happens. So yeah, that's just the way it goes, man. Uh, you act like you're three years old. Uh, somebody had Taco Bell. Bananas and toothpaste for everyone. The Still Winter says. The Still Winters win. Mad, 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 that guy. That guy. Where is that guy? Where did my thing go? Oh yeah, okay, there we go. Where is this person? Where is this person? This guy right here. The Still Winter Nation. You need to go and check him out. Uh, after the show, guys, uh, he plays games and, uh, you know, does all kinds of talk show stuff. Of course, we got Sun City Scratchers, the V3. Check them out as well. Super awesome family-friendly scratching channel. But, again, they are uh, broadcasting to people over the age of 13, I do believe, as well. Guys, the also uh, the uh, host with the most in the trivia chat, Lee Chan Lee. And his puppets, Drago and Polly, man. He's got a great ventriloquism uh, act going on. He does YouTuber Mondays. It's absolutely fantastic. Check him out. And, of course, my real-life wife, Mrs. B. We definitely got to check her out. Mrs. B, Taro and T. Mrs. B, Taro and T. You got to check her out, y'all. She does tarot reading. She does uh, meditation. She does uh, interpretive all kinds of stuff so that being said guys uh, I'm just gonna give you a little sneak preview uh, <clears throat> a new sneak preview of the new segment here a new sneak preview of the new segment and uh, yeah <laughs> we're gonna talk about weird shit we're just gonna find something weird to talk about and it's gonna be fun I think it's gonna be great you know I'm just pull up whatever I want to over here and, uh, you know, we can just talk about whatever. So I think it's going to be fun, guys. we got to find some stuff. In fact, I do have some stuff to talk about already, y'all. Actually, believe it or not, I saw this two hours ago. I saw this two hours ago. This was published on November 22nd, 2019 at 12.56 p.m. Whatever time Puppy. frame that is for you. But... This was published literally today. FTC actions against YouTube and how content owners can determine if their content is directed towards children. So we're going to go over that and so much more on uh, the next segment of Weird <laughs> Shit. So guys, that being said, we're done with that segment. We're moving on. We're going to play some Jackbox games. We're going to play... Uh, what do I have pulled up first? Uh, I have the Jackbox Party Pack 5 pulled up and I've got Jackbox... Uh, See, you don't know Jack full stream. You don't know Jack full stream is what I've got. So let me get the game pulled up here. There it is. All right, let me start the game. Guys, if you've never played one of these Jackbox games before, it's super easy to do. All you got to do is go to jackbox.tv and you can log in using the four-digit room code that I'm about to give you. And, uh, yeah, you do have to log into Twitch. To do that, you got to click on the upper left-hand corner of the screen. There's going to be three horizontal bars. Click that, hit the Twitch button, log in, all that good stuff. Then you come back over here. And when you come back over here, you type in the room code. 
M Y N C M Y N C. You can join the game. This is court. This, of course, is the game. You don't know Jack. So if you want to play, you don't know Jack. You got to head on over to Jackbox.tv right now. You got to get in on the game, guys. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be uncensored, guys. I'm not letting f bombs go just yet, but but maybe maybe we can still be funny. We can still be funny. Let me get the game audio pumped in, y'all, and we're gonna get sto so we're gonna get to started My name real is soon. Whoopsie doodle. Real soon, we got uh, myself we in there. We got Scoobo Man. We got Lee Chan Lee. We got Arcade Arcade. Not YMCA, but YMNC. YMNC and snowflakes and ramen noodles for everyone. Courtesy of the Still Winter Nation rap battle, we'll be doing that. Uh, see, Joke Boat will definitely be doing that. Cammy's in the room. What's up, Cammy? What up? What up? Lee Chan Lee has got the uh, has got. Uh, let's see, what did he say? Oh, he's giving away corn. Right on. Right on. All right, all right. You, Notifications are going off. Have an impact on the game. Okay, Grace by God, what's going on, so Grace by God? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Wedding. So happy that you could join us. Oh, that's How about now? How about now? There we go. There we go. Now we're all better. Grace by God. Thank you so much, Grace by God. Oh my goodness. Game night. That is right, man. That is right. Game night, Grace by God. Thank you so much. Excuse me. Can we ask you about the body found in Walter Creek? Got you on the board. We got you on the board, y'all. Grace by God. Rock on. We're good. We're good. Okay, we got two spots left in the game, guys. Come on in. Jackbox.tv. Jackbox.tv. Let's go. Let's play. Let's go. Let's play. It's 8.43, guys. We don't have much time. We got to go at 8.44. We have to start the game at 8. 44 guys so let us start the game we got less than a minute anybody can join it's absolutely free of charge just go to jackbox.tv mync is the room code it's 844 we're gonna go guys i'm gonna disappear for a second there's a short tutorial i will check y'all on the flip okay okay here we go while we wait for players to join Binge Pipe is proud to resurrect from the dead. You don't know, Jack. Binge Pipe, why not subscribe to one more thing? Hey friends, Cookie Masterson here to tell you that Binge Pipe turns Mondays into fun days and weekends into strong beginnings. And they have an outstanding copywriter. While we wait for the others to get here, I've been working on this monologue where I'm a sea captain who... Oh, oh, you're all here? Uh, never mind. All right, here we go. Start the Time for question one. Time for question one, here we go. Getting started. I had no choice but to retort. Those shoes, though. Officer, I have one question for you. What is those? <coughs> oh, my. The singular form of these, the plural form of this, the singular form of them, or the plural form of that. What are those? The singular form of these, the plural form of this, the singular form of them, and the plural form of that. Um, I don't know. I will guess. The Still Winter Nation, you can't wait to so see. What, what are you doing? Them is a pronoun that can Ooh, be used in the singular or plural, but cannot be used to get you points for this question. Huh. This is the singular form of these, so this is the wrong answer. No. The plural form of this is these. Okay. Those is the plural form of that, as in, I can't believe that cop is wearing those shoes. I can't believe that's not butter. I don't know. If you didn't understand I do the too, reference in this question, you should check out the new true crime series, Fashion Police. I wish there were longer timers as well. I do, I do. 
Let's try a train Who question, you? but not about the band. Say Thomas the Tank Engine is chugging along at work one day when suddenly someone is murdered inside him. <laughs> what would the film based on these events be titled? Murder on the Adventure Bay Express, Murder on the Townsville Express, Murder on the Island of Sodor Express, or Murder on the Neighborhood of Make Believe Express? All right, so uh, Thomas the Tank Engine is chugging along at work one day. Someone is murdered inside of him. What uh, film uh, murder? Uh... Oh, I don't know. A. Hey. Thomas the Tank Engine lives and works on the island of Sodor. Well, isn't that spiffy? The twist is that the passenger actually <laughs> died of heart attack after realizing he was on an island of sentient talking trains. That would certainly freak me out. Yeah, I, I imagine that would freak me out as well. Yeah! <laughs> Sun City! Woo, Sun City! Thank you so much. My goodness, $2 cool sticker with the pair. Rock on, Sun City. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much. Tell me if it's a type of film editing transition or a brand of flushable butt wipes. Think fast, you'll only get a few seconds to pick between a film transition or Sun City! Woohoo! Thank you so much, guys. Thank you for real. Good. Dude wipes. Dude wipes! Film transition or butt wipe? Do, 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 do. What is my main fighting style? Lee Chan Lee, 17 says. Dude wipes! That's a butt wipe, Star man. Wipes. Star wipes! What is it? Film transition or a butt wipe? Film transition, butt wipe! Cubbies, you need to lay off the Taco Bell. <laughs> we, just change your, uh, we just change your sound to Taco Bell. Good wipes! Is that a butt wipe or a film transition, yo? The butt wipe. Clock wipes. Clock wipes. Is that a film transition or a butt wipe? My day isn't a day without BGP. Neither is mine. Water wipes. Water wipes. Film transition or a butt wipe? Is that a wipe for your booty? Is it? V1, V2, V3, what's up? Invisible wipes. Film transition or a butt wipe? Whoa! Seymour's in the house! What's up, dude? Bob's butt wipes. I think that is going to be a butt wipe. Woohoo! Butt wipe! I got them all. Way to go. No, Close I missed one. You. But you geniuses, you really boned up that dis or dat. Binge pipe hurts when you hurt. Sounds like it's screw time. That's right, Cookie. Screwing during a question makes life a little tougher for all the other players in a variety of enjoyable ways. And you'll receive a monetary bonus for anyone who answers incorrectly. Yeah, okay. B-Claw needs they a fancy it. sound thingy. She does. Just one more benefit she of your does. Binge Pipe membership. Mm. Ah. Oh my goodness, the question doesn't care. Exercise is 90% motivation. If someone paid you one dozen double chocolate muffins for every mile you ran, about how many muffins would you earn running a half marathon? Psycho Ducky, dude! Take that! Double chocolate, double chocolate muffins, one dozen dozen double chocolate muffins, or one baker's dozen dozen double chocolate muffins. So watch out. <laughs> Player five has unleashed the screw. I, I got screwed. Oh no, Tic Tac is playing with your phone. Oh, Psycho Ducky, my main man. You're awesome, my dude. You're so awesome. Thank you so much, man. Let's see who got it. Yeah, way to be wrong. I hate to lead you on. None of you got it. Psycho Ducky, look at all of your check marks, man. You're gonna long, fill up the whole board. dozen double chocolate muffins. <laughs> Uh, one baker's Baking dozen. This is essentially oh, just protein man. powder, isn't it? Excellent screwing, player five. Enjoy your cash. Tired of the woods? <laughs> well, I'm glad you could be here. Here's what I like to call Octopus Coffee, Queen Elizabeth, or Frankenstein. I like it. Octopus Coffee, Queen Elizabeth, or Frankenstein. Oh, I like it. I like it. You smell like you need some Subject butt wipes. of an erotic film produced by Andy Warhol. <laughs> Octopus, Coffee, Queen Elizabeth, or Frankenstein? 
All right, subject of an erotic film produced by Andy Warhol. Okay, Octopus what? Coffee, Maybe Queen Elizabeth, or cheating? Frankenstein. <laughs> Andy Warhol's Flesh for Frankenstein was a sexy take on a character made of corpses. The Bee Claw Brood! Oh my goodness, what are you doing too? Wow, oh wow, goodbye. thank you, Beth. Beth, <laughs> thank you so much, Let's take a look. Holy cowsers. Currently, Holy cow. Currently, three is in the lead. And down here, these players are doing the bad thing. Looks like someone needs a little more help. Round two screws have crazier effects. Plus, they oh, bro, thank bonus you so much with the super jigger. The super jigger. So oh the my goodness. You better answer fast if you don't want to be screwed. Oh, and by the way, all the cash in round oh, two is doubled. Now. In case you care about things like that. This is a real party now. Six trombones is not a parade. Hey! This one's known as... First, I'd like to spank the Academy. Which movie won an Oscar for Best Picture in 2006? Well, a let's just find with the out. Same name as a group of well, well. Huh? I got My screwed again. Player two has unleashed the screw. Screw hey, Ready for a little identity theft? Uh. Best Picture, the Oscar. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> what do you guys think? A, B, C, or D? Too okay, late. You pick? Oh, I hate these you timers, miss all man. all the shots you don't take, and this one. <laughs> Why don't I save you all the embarrassment? A group of rhinos is called a crash, and the Paul Haggis film Crash won Best Picture in 2006. Uh -huh. Brokeback Mountain should have <laughs> won. It's taken 12 years of therapy for me to get to a point where I can say that plainly and without anger, but Brokeback Mountain should have won. <laughs> a sweepy! Okay, it. it's, it's done. Nice screwing, player two. I believe this belongs to you. Oh, scuba oh, man. I see we have some new names. Like they say, a rose by any other name still gets screwed. I shall be known as Cannon Fodder. Cannon Fodder. Ooh, I like it. <laughs> happy Lux from Luxembourg. Hello, hello, Happy Lux. How are you? Welcome. My name is Sean. This is Vaxi Girl Productions. Murderous clown monster Pennywise is at it again, telling the children of Derry, you'll float too. Mm. How else could Pennywise phrase his favorite threat? Your upward AM, pressure wow. is equal to your density, Richie. The mass of your displaced liquid is greater than your downward gravity, Stan. Your average volume is consistent with Archimedes' principle, Beverly. Or your surface area cancels out... Brace yourself. <laughs> I Maybe shall screw you, snake vomit! Uh, <laughs> Great, my God! On this question. Uh, mic check one two. Two seconds. One second. Zero oh, seconds. Nobody picks that one. Nobody. Yeah, that's uh, it. That's it. Remember I got it right. Woo! Scary. That screw is a good move, player one. Thank Here's you. Here's your extra cash. Now I'm only fifteen hundred in the hole. <laughs> Mic check one two. Hey. 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 Mm, At choice. binge pipe, we value your needs. Would you like a loud question or a quiet Prost. question? Use your device to select your preference. Prost. Ah, loud or quiet? I want a loud question. Here are the consequences of your choices. Here are the consequences of your choices. You have engaged with the process. Engaged the process. Well, then I learned to heed the winds of it. Yes. <laughs> Here's one for you. A loud question. Yes, please. Which of these songs is on the Rihanna album loud? <laughs> Take it off. Man down. What the hell? Or boom, boom, pow. Oh, what the hell? Take it off. Man down. Boom, boom, pow. Let's see how that shook out. Happy no! looks, happy looks. So happy to see you, sir. I'm glad wrong. that you're here. Boom Boom Pal is wrong. I can see why you would think that, but no. <clears throat> Man Down is a track on the 2010 Rihanna album, Loud. Man Down, Man Down. I'm sorry. <clears throat> I use the volume usually reserved for my cats when they hop on furniture. <laughs> Happy Lush Mutko Loco. <laughs> Question 9. Oh, Feast yeah. your eyes upon this. K 
cat scratch undiagnosed medical condition. So I'm trying out a new vet, and I'm not sure I like this guy. The vet diagnosed my cat Poopsie with catamenia, but something tells me that's not likely because cats don't sweat, cats don't menstruate, cats don't see color, or cats don't get dandruff. Um, I'm going to go with cats don't see color, I think. I think I'm going to go with cats don't see color. And I'm going to... I'm going I love to this part. Coffee. Cats do sweat. It's why they don't play poker. <laughs> I know the cats sweat. Is another word for menstrual flow, but cats don't menstruate when they're in heat. Okay. Interesting. Besides, Oopsie is a boy. I I think. Interesting. Mucho loco si ti. Question 10. There is no hiding from NSFW GPS. Uh oh. Where's the G spot? Between a guitar's D and A strings, between a guitar's B and D strings, between a guitar's B and E strings, or between a guitar's F and H strings. I don't know. Uh -oh. On many more weeks to come, you'll come Where's back in action, happy luck. No, don't worry. Where's the G spot? Woo wee! What a question. What a How question. Sweetheart, are your fingers getting tired? <laughs> Just keep feeling around. You'll find it. <laughs> so play a G on a guitar. I love it. Pluck the string between the B and D strings. Woo! Me, I'm losing. <laughs> Excellent screwing player six. Look at our scores. Cash. We're all doing awful except for Scuba Man. <laughs> I love it. Oh, this is great. Whoa. Typing like shit with your elbows. <laughs> I'm sorry, Welcome Sun City. The I'm sorry, your elbows when feel you like shit. you see an answer that matches the category, tap it on your device. The faster you pick a right answer, the more cash you make. You're and doing more bad. Than one answer can be right, but each time you're wrong, I'm taking some cash away. And be careful. It's gotta be a match that fits this clue. Brand name faces. I hope you know what your brand mascots look like. I do. Capitalist drone. Brand name. I'm confused. Rabbits. Okay. Birds. Birds! Oh no, I got that one wrong. Alright, brand name words. Um, uh, da -da. Yes, that one, that one. All of them! Everybody's exploding! Oh my goodness! Y'all need some stars. Y'all need some stars! Here, have some stars! Y'all jump for the stars! Jump for the stars, everybody! Baldies. Baldies. <laughs> oh, oh, Jackbox Games, Brawny, Pringles, Six Flags, Mr. Clean, Green Giant, these things that are bald. With hats. Things with hats. Let's see, Frosted Flakes, Quaker Oats, Brawny, Jack in the Box, Chiquita. <laughs> Man, all these people winning up all those stars for points. All right, sunglasses, Cheetos, Frosted Flakes, Goldfish, Energizer, 7-Up, Hawaiian Punch. Things with sunglasses in the logo. Whoop, whoop. Toot, toot, gotta scoop. Without pants, Pillsbury, Tricks, Duracell. Cheetos, Fruity Loops, Rice Krispies. This is fun. This is fun. I like this game. This is a good game. Final scores. Grace by God, Lee Chan Lee, Scuba Man. Bertu! Congratulations, my friend. I hope you feel good about that. I mean, like. 
meaningless and we'll all die alone, but remember a win's a win, and here's something else to remember. You don't know Jack! <laughs> GG, everybody! GG, that's the way we go. That's the way we roll around here. <laughs> Scuba Man! Give it up for Scuba Man. My main man, Scuba Man, winning. The first game of the night, dude. Congratulations. Doreen said that she will be here shortly. Hello, Cherry Berry. Hello, hello. Welcome to the show, Cherry Berry. Glad you could be here. I'm so happy that you could make it tonight. We're having fun. We're playing games on the internet. We've, uh, we're playing some uncensored games uh, for the most part this evening. Uh, it's going to be fun. It has been fun. We got uh, a few Australian lottery tickets. BGGP. That's right, man. We got some uh, Australian lottery tickets. Uh, the Still Winter Nation says, "Howdy doody, howdy doody." Let's see. Um, let's see. Uh, what what can we rhyme with howdy doody to say? Uh, like and share the stream. <laughs> if you could, if you don't mind, I certainly, I certainly, I certainly would appreciate it. I certainly would appreciate it. You can buy one of those, too, if you would like to. But, yeah, guys, uh, if you would like to uh, share the stream, please feel free. I would love for you to do that. Get as many people as you can in here, guys. We've got Australian lottery tickets to scratch. Um, let me show you those. Uh, I got some Australian lottery tickets sitting right over there just waiting to be scratched. And then uh, we also have, uh, you know, a couple of different segments going on. Uh, we got more Jackbox games coming up. Uh, so... One and all, it is the Cherry Berry 48. Awesome channel. Awesome channel, by the way, Cherry Berry. Uh, so yeah, we got more Jackbox games. So let's go back to the party pack. Let's uh, fire up another Jackbox game. But before we get into that, let's try something else that we do around here from time to time, guys. You're about to be abducted by an alien. Have fun! Alrighty, everybody, you just got abducted by the aliens. Now you're fighting it out on the arena floor. You're all battling it out for corn. What the hell are you going to do with corn? You're going to spin it in the chat. We got mini games. We got slot machines. We got roulette wheels. You can upgrade your avatars. Speaking of upgrade your avatars, as a mod, no, uh, you are not, uh, you don't have the, the permissions to uh, gift avatars. However, you can gift enough corn for someone to buy an avatar. Happy Lux, Tarot and T with Mrs. B, Arcade, Arcade. Narrowly avoiding that health pack. That was not the smartest of moves. But you have no control over it. There he goes. Tarot and T. Tarot and T with Mrs. B. Give it up for her. Mrs. B. You know who I am. Who am I? All right. That was fun, guys. You know what happened? What happened there was Mrs. B won 500 corn. She can spin that on the new avatar. She can spin that on a whole bunch of stuff right here in the chat, guys. And uh, just for being here, just for participating, guys, everybody in the chat room right now is going to get 50 corn. And you know what? On top of that, I'm feeling extra generous right now. I'm feeling extra generous. I'm going to give everybody in the chat another 50 corn. So good game, everybody. Thank you for being here. We ain't done. Not by a long shot. We're not done. <laughs> All right, y'all. All right, y'all. Let's get back to the Jackbox games, guys. And then after that, maybe we'll scratch off a lottery ticket. We'll see. We'll find out. Let's go back to the party pack. Let's see what we're going to play next. Let's see what we're going to play next, guys. Uh, the stream avatar link. Uh, it's Bang Extension. Uh, let me get that in the chat. There we go. Oh, yeah. This is also a perfect opportunity. I'm going to do a, a coffee pour is what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a coffee pour. Oh, crap. That's not what I wanted. Uh, let's go over here. Yeah. All right, so I want to thank everybody here. I want to thank Mrs. Amanda. I want to thank Carson Claus, Howard Matlock, The Psycho Ducky, Sunseen Scratchers, The V3, Deadpool, Rhino Scratches, Fantastic Wit, B Claw Brood, Graced by God. Thank you all so very much. You're absolutely amazing. I'm going to set this down right here. And we are going to have a pouring of the coffee, ladies and gentlemen. Pouring of the coffee. That's right. We shall have a pouring of the coffee. Uh, I have a brand new uh, cop pot. Uh, a friend. A bit, a bit, I can't talk. I can't talk. We have a, a whole pot of coffee over here. Huh? Let's see. Where's my sugar at? 
First, we have to have the pouring of the sugar in order to have the pouring of the coffee. So the pouring of the sugar shall commence. That should be enough. Maybe a little bit more. So, guys, you are all truly, truly amazing. Uh, truly, truly amazing, guys. And I would like to thank each and every one of you. Everyone that has super chatted. Everyone that is just here. Those of you on the board, you get your special shout out right now. So, ladies and gentlemen, boys. Nope, not, not that one. Just ladies and gentlemen, everybody in the room tonight, we shall salute all the super chats of the week so far. Mrs. Amanda, the B-Claw Brood, Carson Claus, Howard Madlock, Psycho Ducky, Sun City Scratchers, the V3, Deadpool, Rhino Scratches, Fantastic Wit, Graced by God, a man named Psycho Ducky, and I don't know who the hell he is, but he's from somewhere down under where everything tries to kill you. So, ladies and gentlemen, raise your glasses, a toast, and a coffee pour to you. Coffee, coffee, buzz, buzz, buzz. Let's go. Let's stir it up, everybody. Let's stir it up, everybody. Thank you, oh, so much, B Claw. Thank you, oh, so much, B Claw Brood. Well, that's good. Boy, that's good. Oh, Mrs. Amanda, thank you so much. Oh, thank you so much. You didn't have to do No, y'all don't have to do that. Mrs. Amanda, Beaklaw Brood, you both get more check marks on the board. You both get more check marks on the board. Use your mirror of courage and flash it in Scuba Man's eyes to reflect his blame. Oh, what have you done? What have you blamed the Still Winter on? Oh, what did you blame the Still Winter? <laughs> Oh, you guys are awesome. Whoa, all that sugar. Gorilla for president. Uh, you need a sound command. Yeah, uh, yeah, we need a sound command. Unfortunately, everything runs through my soundboard. And as, uh, as everything runs through my soundboard, I, uh, you wouldn't be able to hear it anyway, unfortunately. Um, but, uh, we, we, we got stuff to, we got stuff to do, guys. All that sugar. Uh, time to change rooms and wait for your laptop. Yep, um, let's see, uh, speaking of what, uh, what did you miss? Yep, we have, uh, new rules. Psycho Ducky just posted the new rules. Those are new rules. Spamming. Asking for real names and or personal info. Trying to get laid. Trolling, rudeness, racism, bigotry. Condescending behavior not be tolerated. You will be timed out. Probably banned. So say it's me. <laughs> Oh, I do, I do, I do. I used to have a, a band hammer in here. Let me see. Let me see if I still have this. Oh, I don't guess so. Grace by God. Oh, my goodness. Grace by God. Thank you so much. $2 Canadian with the, the dancing with the hearts. The dancing with the heart. Oh, for, I was shaking me nuts. I was shaking me nuts. Oh, it's getting weird in here tonight, isn't it? Woo, oh my goodness. Grace by God. Kathy Solo, oh my God. Oh my God, Kathy Solo. See, the Grace by God, Kathy Solo. Let's see, Kathy, you need to make the board. Kathy Solo, thank you so much, Kathy. Thank you so very much. Oh, where you? There it goes. Woo! We'll get big again. We'll get big again, yo. Woohoo! You guys are amazing, y'all. You guys are amazing. Totally, totally amazing. We're gonna play. We're gonna play one more Jackbox game. And then, oh, Happy Lux, I will see you later. I will see you later. Thank you so much, uh, Happy Lux. Thank you for being here, man. Uh, always part of the Gorilla Fam Bam, dude. Always part of the Gorilla Fam Bam. Totally, totally awesome. Tell all your friends, come back tomorrow. I'm on five nights a week starting on uh, Wednesdays at 8.30 Central Standard Time and 8.30 Central Standard Time Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Uh, the streaming schedule is kind of up in the air, so we're just going to do whatever the hell I feel like it pretty much. And tonight is Jackbox Night, and we're going to play some games. Right now, I want to play Split the Room, guys, so all you got to do is tune in to Jackbox.tv on a second device, a browser, a second screen, if you will. And you will be able to 
log into jackbox.tv, you got to go to uh, that uh, website in the upper left hand corner of the screen. There's going to be three horizontal bars. These three horizontal bars, you need to click on those, log in using your Twitch credentials. Once you do that, then you shall be able to come back and log into the game using a four digit room code. Um, is this Wario? Yes, it certainly is Wario. It is, it is, it is. Um, this is the uh, special modified edition. Uh, the special modified edition. This is the the dog edition, actually. This is the dog edition of Wario. Why the dog edition? Well, I'll tell you why this is the dog edition of Wario. Um, if I tell you the room code, you're going to get it. So here we go. The room code, if you want to join into this Jackbox game that's totally free of charge to play for anybody over the age of, eh, let's just say 14 for the sake of for safety. Here's your room code, guys. Bow Wow. It's the dog version of Wario. Bow Wow. B W O W. Bow Wow is the room code, guys. Come on in. It's, it's ironic. There's a kitty cat on the screen. Isn't that great? Look at that kitty cat. Isn't he cute? Isn't he cute? I think he's cute. Let's pump some game audio in here, guys. Join us. Okay, we're filling up the room fast, guys. Everybody's in here. Who all's in here? I gotta say hello to everybody. Backseat. Hey, that's me. I'm backseat. Woo! Give it up. Give it up for me. <laughs> Thank you guys, so, you're too kind, you're too kind. Alright, Cubbies for Life, what's up bro? Welcome dude, welcome, welcome. More stars of the show include Scuba Man, Cameron, uh, let's see, Cammy Blue on the move, Lee Chan Lee, Rhino or Bust, Arcade Arcade, and Graced by God, guys. Give it up for your uh, fellow contestants on this game show. We're going to start the game in 3, 2, 1, go. Listen up. Meow, do not be startled. I am here to guide you as we explore the deepest recesses of your mind. You will build strange and complex worlds using only your imagination and your thumbs. A hypothetical situation missing one key part will be transmitted to your device like this one. Ads before online videos have been banished. In their place are 15 second <coughs> videos of this. They are not skippable. Is life better? There are infinite possibilities you could write in to complete this scenario. Choose wisely, though, because everybody else will then answer yes or no. What's up, random channel? You will earn more going, points man? if you split the room. Fitting name, huh? For those of you in the audience, you'll be competing as one player. Your answers will be determined by a majority vote. Yes, even in a nebulous void, democracy is important. At the end of the game, the person who creates the most divisive dimensions will win. Got it? Good. Now let's begin. Let's go! Cubbies for life, what's up dude? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for being in here. Random channel. It's a fantasy and reality. Two blocks down from Logic Avenue, just across from Impossible Boulevard, there is a great bagel shop. But now, it's time to split the room. Do -do 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 -do. This is a fun game, guys. This scenario this really is. your device. All right, complete the scenario on your device, guys. Questions and answers, blanks and fill them in. It's kind of like Mad Libs, except it's asking you questions in which you, it's up to you, you have to split the room. It's a yes or no kind of situation. Would you rather do this or would you rather do that? Or would you do this or would you not? Uh, you know, like what finger would you cut off if you had to choose one? Stuff like that. <laughs> so, uh, you da 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 Let me fill in my answer. All right, complete the scenario on your device. You've got less than a minute to do it. May you get in the next game. Random channel, absolutely. Okay, so how we play is everybody gets the room code at the exact same time. It's the first seven players besides myself. Well, the first eight players besides myself, so that would be seven players. The first seven players to type in that room code are eligible to get in on the game. You can also join the audience right now. If you'd like to join the audience right now, you can go to jackbox.tv, enter in that room code BWOW, and you can have an influence on the game. Uh, so, yeah, feel Feel free, go on over there. Here's and, what I uh, like to call. Cool. Make peace. Make peace. A small cult has moved in a few miles down the road from you. Sweet. Another day in Connecticut. From your experiences, they're an honest, respectful, and charitable group. But each day, they spend an hour praying to this figure. Do you okay. call the authorities on them? Nope. No, I really don't care. If they pray to cows, cows are cool. I like cows. I like cows. Medium rare, rare, heavily seasoned. 
um, preferably with a nice charred crust. Um, well, I'm a fan of many animals that way, but uh, mainly cows. Yeah, the uh, the ribeye portion. Um, <laughs> I'm joking, guys. I'm, I'm sorry for all the vegetarians out there, but I am a meat eater. Oh, we don't care if you pray to the cows, man. <laughs> what game's next? Um, oh, the man. longer it takes Mad the City? to answer, the more bonus points you get. Maybe. What do you want to play? Later day steakinism. That's right, Psycho Our Ducky. Next is awkward on many levels. <laughs> I check one too. You're trapped in a stalled elevator with your annoying boss. Oh. A fairy only you can see tells you to do this. Otherwise, it'll be 18 okay. hours do that. before you're rescued. Do you do it? Oh, I have eaten duck meat before. There used to be a place up in Jackson, Tennessee called, uh, I forget what. But uh, they had a, uh, a duck quesadilla, and man, that thing was quacking good, man. That was so quacking good. Happy, <laughs> happy Howard Matlock Day, everyone. I've just announced it right here on the stream. It's official BGP holiday. It's an official BGP holiday right there. It's, uh, it's Howard Matlock Day. Howard Matlock Day. Give it up for Howard Matlock. Welcome, welcome. You're trapped inside that stalled elevator. Uh, fairy, you can only see, uh, tells you to fly, otherwise it'll be 18 hours. Uh, do you fly? Oh, yeah? Yeah? Have you ever seen the poor dude that was sick in an elevator for three days? Stuck in an elevator for three days? Um, no. I bet that was awful, though. I bet that was awesome. Cammy got the points. No and split, now, though. Pipe presents Technology has made us lazy. Meat and potatoes. Oh yeah. You discover where like all birds the bees went. After speaking with their queen, they agree to come back in exchange for this. You spoke of with the queen bee. Be stung one hundred times on your elbow. Matt Lock Day. The psycho ducky says, "Oh my, God. psycho ducky, what are you doing?" I think Tick and Tack did get in on your phone. I think Tick and Tack did get in on your phone. Two dollar Australian. My gosh, man. My gosh, dude. Oh, thank you, Psycho Ducky. Check marks for Psycho Ducky. Psycho Ducky, man, you are amazing. Thank you, Psycho Ducky. Oh my gosh, everybody on the board. Seriously, guys. Wow. I split the room pretty good on that one. Who wants to get stung by bees 100 times on the elbow? Three to five split, not bad. Look at that green croc. Isn't that thing sweet? Feast your eyes on. <laughs> Ducky, did you win the lot? Not on these tickets, service. he didn't. <laughs> he did, he sent me like 60 bucks in lottery tickets and not one of them has hit so far. It's, 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 it's really sad. This served off your naked body at a fancy party. One of the people dining is this player. Do you do it? Schoolman says Ducky is kicking ass with the donations. He is, man. He found the biggest donkey in the room and is kicking it. <laughs> Have you been offered $5,000 to lie on a table for one hour and have onion soup served off of your naked body at a fancy party? One of the people dining is Scuba Man. Oh, $5,000? Hmm. 5,000 bucks is 5,000 bucks. It is. <laughs> Making new friends. Random channel, maybe non the names. non the names? No. <laughs> Most people are like, yep, <laughs> Scuba Man is probably seen worse. I, I, I believe that. Probably so. Probably so. <laughs> oh. Brace yourself for for a good that question, cause. though. <laughs> Throw it in the cheese, I'm sold. A charity raising money for stray pets asks you to participate in a fundraiser. How do they want you to help generate money? Well, by doing this. Stripping. Do you agree to it? Charity raising money for stray pets asks you to uh, participate in a fundraiser. How do they want you to generate money by stripping? Do you do it? I don't know, man. But I'll shake me nuts. I will. I will shake me peanuts. I sure will. I will. I will. No. <laughs> Most everybody. Who's in that list? Who's in that list? I want to see. Who are you? Who are you in there? <laughs> Feck, yes. I will accept facts. Facts are okay. Feckin' right. Stripping or shaking nuts. <laughs> this one is called Love at First Bite. <laughs> You're desperately single. Hard to imagine, I'm sure. There's a new dating app that guarantees you'll find your soulmate. Ooh. In order to set up an account, you have to upload <clears throat> this. A Do naked you photo. Alright, so you're desperately single. There's a new dating app that guarantees you'll find a new soulmate. In order to set up an account, you have to upload a naked photo for 18 and up. Do you do it? No. I'm good. I'm good. 
I'm not that desperate. <laughs> Same thing. No. Anyone swim with sharks yet? I have in the wild. Ooh. Ooh. No, I have swam with dolphins and octopus and um, a few other under the sea creatures. Scoop a man through your five split. Nope. Race by God. James says nope. And you, now. Not that you've done it recently. License to drive. <laughs> Ah, driver's license. Due to a glitch in your self-driving car, it's taking you directly to this place. Tesla's taking you to hell. It's your favorite destination. Mm -hmm. Your mom is in the car with you. <laughs> if you override the system, it will careen off the road. Do you override it? Um, what? <laughs> All right, due to a glitch in your self-driving car. All right, so your Tesla just went flipping nuts. All right, it's making you go directly to hell. It's labeled as your favorite destination. <laughs> your mom is in the car with you. If you override the system, it will careen off the road. Do you override it? Yeah, probably. It's pretty flat out here. I mean, I don't know. If we're going to hell, you might as well have fun going, right? <laughs> Isn't that you? Never mind. <laughs> I have dolphins to... Or I have two dolphins, mantises. Random channel wants to go to hell. Oh, you're funny. Mrs. and Mrs. B, hello. Who was that? Who was that? Doreen! Hello, Doreen. Welcome. Where did my thing go? <laughs> <laughs> Most people tell Psycho Ducky to go to hell. You're gonna go to hell and you're gonna enjoy it. Hey. Grace by God, GBG. This scenario is called One Small Misstep. One Small Misstep. You were a crew member during the first moon landing in 1969. Okay. You possess footage that would once and for all put an end to the conspiracy theory that it was staged. But in this clip, you're heard yelling this. Do you release it to the public? Take off your space helmet if you want to live, boy. <laughs> All right, so you're uh, you're a crew member during the first moon landing in '69. '69. Uh, you post uh, footage, or you possess footage that would once and for all put an end to the conspiracy that it was all staged. But in this clip, you're heard yelling, "Take off your space helmet if you want to live." Do you release it to the public? How much money? How much of them dollar dollars? How much? How much? Maybe. Yeah. I mean. Take off your helmet if you want to live. Slip the room. Look at that kitty cat. Oh, look at that kitty cat. Doreen's in the room. Arcade. Arcade's in here. Woohoo! Random channel would do it. He'd take off his helmet. He'd, he'd post that footage. Yeah, he would. Let's check in with the standings. Meow. I'm no good with this leaderboard, so y'all can read. <laughs> We've reached Cherry Berry! What's up? Everybody will be presented with a new type of scenario. Ooh. There will be two options to choose from. Door number one is already provided. Boss up, everybody! Bang boss in the chat, two. yo! Remember, you want to make it as hard of a choice as possible. Oh, and if you correctly predict a certain player's decision, you'll earn some bonus points. Let's begin. <laughs> Let's begin! Shall we? An option that you think only some people would choose. Only some people. All right, so complete the scenario on your device, guys. Here it is. More questions, more answers, more fill in the blank stuff. You're trying to split the room down to the decision. Mic check one, two, whoever that was. Fantastic wit. Um, uh, Beth B. Claw, think about what uh, what kind of sound effect you would like. And if you would like to check out a sound effect, just go to Epidemic Sound, and uh, you can check out their effects uh, department over there. And uh, tell me which one you want, and uh, I will make that sound effect happen for you, Miss B. Claw Brood. Just for you, you will have your own customized sound effect, just like anybody else. And the Matlocks as well. Um, Matlocks, if you want a uh, customized sound effect, please uh, you just check out Epidemic Sound Sound Library, and I'll be more than happy to give you your own personalized sound effect. Um, let's see. Uh, here we go. Hmm. Okay, Cherry Berry wants one. <laughs> you want a Rickroll? I don't know that I can uh, do a Rickroll, but uh, yeah, you guys got to go over to Epidemic Sound and uh, f uh, find the sound effect that you want, guys. Go to Epidemic Sound and find the sound effect that you want, or else you leave it to me. If you leave it to me, it's kind of scary. <laughs> if you leave it to me, it's kind of scary. So just let me know. <laughs> oh dear, Mrs. B already has one. It goes ding ding. Time's running <laughs> out. Random channel. I. Complete the scenario on your device for bonus points. Okay. Um. 
for one hour, hour only, everyone but you vanishes from the world. If only. The world is empty and unlocked. You could go through your neighbor's houses or do this. How do you spend your precious hour? Random channel wants a random one, leave it to me. All right, for one hour only. Everyone but you vanishes from the world. The world is empty and unlocked. You could go through your neighbor's houses or smoke as much as possible. How do you spend your precious hour? Snoop on your neighbors or smoke as much as possible? I'll probably go with uh, snoop on your neighbors because, I mean, an hour is only an hour. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know, man. No dice. You do like the sound of Big Ben. Ah, the Big Ben. I see. All right, snoop on your neighbors. Steal all the tech from fries. Um... Hmm, snoop on your neighbors. Steal all the tech from fries. Which one would you do? Check my sound files here. Oh, hey, Wit. Hey, Wit, check this out. Maybe. You didn't see that coming. Not working. Hmm. Oh, well. All right, for one hour only, everyone but you vanishes. All right, so do you go to the arcade or do you snoop on your neighbors? Your your neighbors? Your neighbors? I I go to the arcade, man. <laughs> there are a lot. There are some things I would do before some things. Uh -huh. Moving on. Hmm. You're on a first date at the cinema. Unfortunately, there are only two movies playing. One is a documentary about genocide, and the other is this. Which movie do you see on a first date? You're on a first date at the cinema. Unfortunately, there are only two movies. All right, one's a documentary about genocide, and the other one is a documentary about sharks. Which movie do you see on the first date? I'm gonna go with the, uh, I'm gonna go with the sharks, I think. I'm gonna go with the sharks. That's what I'm going to do. Yes, it is a documentary about sharks. Vacuum your nipples. That is what we're going to do. We're going to vacuum your nipples. Actually, yes, yes. We're going to vacuum your, uh, uh, the psycho ducky. Yes, yes, right there. Right there. Right there. All right, there we go. There we go. Next up, who we got? <laughs> Which movie do you see? A movie about genocide, Doc? Or about cannibalism? Ooh, the cannibalism sounds fun. That sounds fun. The cannibalism does. Yes, it does. None of you are getting a second date. There's a new command. Don't abuse it. That's my, uh, that's my, uh, adjust something command. If you need to get my attention for any reason, that is the horn to do it. <laughs> All right, whale sounds, genocide docs. Which movie do you see, whale sounds or genocide docs? I think that the genocide doc is going to be more appropriate for a first, a first, um, <clears throat> a first movie. So, oh, finally, <laughs> you love it. Nice. <laughs> whale sounds, Cherry Berry says. Now for something different. No, for something In the future, different. you are assigned jobs by the government at age 16. Ooh. You can either become a maggot farmer or <laughs> this vocation. Which mandated job do you take? Oh gosh. All right, you can be a maggot farmer or you can be a turd splitter. <laughs> you can be a maggot farmer or a turd splitter. I think I'll be the maggot farmer. Although you might find some uh, interesting things in the... Uh, you might find some interesting things in the... Uh, <laughs> You'll really stand out on LinkedIn. All right, maggot farmer or uh, frog farmer? I'm gonna go with the frog farmer. That sounds interesting. Farming frogs for a living. I don't know what you would do with them, but uh, <laughs> the hell why? How do you do, neighbor? Horn, how do you do, neighbor? The hell why? One, ha ha ha! I'll pass, ha. <laughs> Pretty sure my one-year-old niece is a hundred-dollar bill a couple of days ago. What? Frog farm, scoop man, you got that one. That took dealing with shit to a whole new level. <laughs> it sure did, what? Didn't it? Frog butts are delicious. I've never had a frog butt. I've had frog legs. I have maggot farmer or tightrope walker. Tightrope walking could be fun. 
It could be. Probably fall down a lot, probably get multiple broken bones and concussions, but we would all rather walk a tightrope than, uh, Someone's a mind than mine some maggots. Mining maggots. Mind your own maggots. <laughs> That's a good one. Mind your own maggots, scumbag. <laughs> it all comes down to this. <sighs> Refreshing coffee. Oh, it's delicious. Oh, we have a winner. Arcade! <clears throat> arcade, arcade! Congratulations go to you, my friend. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Uh, who is Nick Wildke? I don't know. G, 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 G! Good game, good game, good game. G, G, good game. You guys are awesome, man. You guys are totally, totally amazing. Totally, totally amazing. Okay, guys, so. Oh, so, so amazing. Congratulations. I think that it is now time. Let's talk weird shit. Y'all want to talk about weird shit? Okay, we can talk about some weird shit. Let's talk about some weird shit. Let me uh, turn this off right here. Let me turn that on right there. Let me turn that on right there. Okay, guys, so y'all want to talk about some weird shit? We'll talk about some weird shit. We are going to talk about some weird shit right here on BGP. Let me find something that we can talk about. Let me find something that we can talk about. What kind of stuff do we want to talk about on this segment of weird shit? Hmm. All right, we're going to talk about one of my favorite songs, actually. We're going to talk about one of my favorite songs. It's actually a nursing, or a nursery, a nursing rhyme, nursery rhyme kind of situation. Guys, today on this uh, on this segment of Let's Talk About Weird Shit, we are going to talk about Pop Goes the Weasel. You've all heard it. You all know what it is. It's Pop Goes the Weasel, right? So, it's an English nursery rhyme and singing game. It has a Roud Folk Song Index number of 5249, and it's Austin used in Jack in the Box toys. Okay? Now, I got to wondering about this, and uh, here are the lyrics, right? So, half a pound of tuppany rice, half a pound of treacle. That's the way the money goes, pop goes the weasel. And then uh, there's perhaps a second and third verse that says, Every night when I go out, the monkey's on the table. Take a stick and knock it off, pop goes the weasel. And then we have up and down the city road, and in and out the eagle. That's the way the money goes. Pop goes the weasel. All right, so... All nursery rhymes are really demented when you look at them. Uh, yes, yes, they are. So the origins, this is where it really where it really got uh, interesting to me, guys. Um, it all comes down to, basically, the meanings and the interpretations. The meaning and the interpretations. So, <clears throat> perhaps because of the most obscure nature of the various lyrics, there have been many suggestions for what they mean, particularly the phrase, Pop Goes the Weasel. Uh, including, that is a tailor's flat iron, a tailor's flat iron, a dead weasel, a hatter's tool, a spinner's weasel, a, a used for mis uh, measuring and spinning, uh, a piece of a silver plate, a weasel and stort or something like that, um, and uh, that's the way the money goes, um, and there was one in here that I really was interested in, um, it was, uh, let's see if I can find it, let's see if I can find it. Let's see if I can find it. Uh, demand for payments, uh, all kinds of stuff. But uh, anyway, I'll find the origin of that later. Um, ba dum bum bum. Yeah. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. So, anywho, that is uh, this edition of Let's Talk About Weird Shit. So, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you enjoyed this little segment of Let's talk about weird shit on BGP, guys. Uh, what do you say? Y'all want to scratch some more lottery tickets, perhaps? Would y'all like to scratch some more lottery tickets, maybe? <laughs> oh, you want a battle? You want a battle? Oh, we can do a battle. We can do a battle, most certainly. I'll abduct you. Let the aliens do it, that is.
The battle has started and all of you are going to perish except for one. One stream avatar will rise above all of the rest and you shall be declared the winner of 500 corn. Who's going to survive, guys? This is going to be Sun City Scratchers. Nope, there they go. Blown all the smithereens. Look at Scratch and go crazy with that Mahjong Boo in there. See ya! I'm just going to stop calling out names. You all seem to be exploding. Whenever I call out your name, you seem to explode. Uh oh my goodness, two people left, three people left. Cherry Berry Psycho Ducky, fantastic wit. Wits on the move, there's Cherry Berry Psycho Ducky, uh oh, here comes the health pack, here comes the health pack, nobody's gonna get the health pack, Fantastic Wit got the health pack, rock on, there goes Cherry Berry, Fantastic Wit and the Psycho Ducky, Fantastic Wit and the Psycho Ducky, there it is, Fantastic Wit, Fantastic Wit with the orange Yoshi doing her little dance, give it up for Fantastic Wit, GG. I love this part. I love this part. Isn't this a fun game? Isn't this a fun game? Congratulations! Congratulations! And uh, I tell you what, guys, uh, just for being here, just for being here, we're gonna give everybody in the chat some points, guys. Everybody in the chat's gonna get. Uh, everybody in the chat's gonna get 100 points just for being here right now. 100 points just for being here. Uh, you never won, only that one time. Oh, so congratulations, everybody. Good game. Thank you all for being a part of the Grow Up Fam Bam. You guys are all so, so very amazing, guys. <laughs> Mic check one, two. My name's Sean. I like to have fun and play games on this whole internet thing five nights a week, man. Wednesday through Sunday at 8.30 p.m. Most of the times it's either going to be Jackbox games or Mario or some more strange stuff. So uh, if you want to be a part of the action, make sure you are subscribed. Turn on that notification bell. Share the stream, guys. Tell everybody that you know. Tell them in person. Tell them to go to bgp.rip. That's right. That's my website. www.bgp.rip. Come on in, that redirects you right here so you'll never miss out on anything that I upload. Streaming five nights a week, guys. Now we have a decision. We have a decision. We have a decision. Is that like Bob's your uncle? <laughs> I, uh, I guess, yeah, Bob's your uncle. Hey, speaking of Bob's your uncle. Speaking of Bob's your uncle, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's, let's take a look at that on our next segment of, uh, of, uh, of weird shit. <laughs> scratchies! Doreen wants to do some scratchies, guys. I have Australian scratchies. I have Australian scratchies. Let's get big up here. I have Australian scratchies. These are from Down Under. My brother from Down Under, the Psycho Ducky himself. The one that uh, has been dropping cheese in the chat like it's a cheddar factory. I don't know what this man is up to, but uh, he has provided us with some Australian scratchies. So I think it's time that we go and do some scratchies. Doreen wants to do some scratchies. Scuba Man wants to see that battleship game. All right, Scuba Man wants to see the battleship. Doreen wants to see the battleship. Oh, y'all want the battleship game? I think we can do the battleship game. Doreen rocks. This is Amanda rocks. This is Amanda rocks. You know why we have this? Uh, why we have this opportunity? International scratchies. Woohoo! While we have this opportunity, I do want to thank everybody on the super chat board. Sincerely, from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys for letting this channel happen uh, by your uh, generous support. It's never necessary. Um, but guys, really, truly, thank you, uh, Mrs. Amanda, Carson Claus, Howard Matlock. Psycho Ducky, Sun City Scratchers, the V3, Deadpool, Rhino Scratches, Fantastic Wit, B Clomp Rude, Grace by God, Kathy Solo, Psycho Ducky again, Bob Gerante. <laughs> Bob Gerante. Psycho Ducky, you crazy clacker. You crazy clacker. Oh my goodness, dude. You, you're, you're running out of rooms on the board. I'm, <laughs> Psycho Ducky needs his own board. Psycho Ducky needs his own board. All right, uh, Lee Chan Lee says, I'll give any of you 1,000 corn if you can guess what number I'm thinking of. One to 100. Oh my, this could get dangerous. Let's go scratch some Aussie scratchers. What do you say? I'll meet you all over there. Alrighty, y'all. Let's get in on the action, guys. We got Australian scratch cars all the way from down under. All the way from down under. Down under. Yes, yes. Australian scratch off lottery tickets. It's pretty cool, man. Courtesy of the Psycho Ducky. That crazy quacker. Damn it. Come on. Get where I want you to stay at, chat box. So I, want, so I can see. I have to see the chat box. If I can't see the chat box, then, well, that would suck, wouldn't it? 
And Streamlabs doesn't want to cooperate anymore. Uh, stop that. All right, good enough. Good enough. Let's do that right there. And now we can all see what we're doing. This is great. Hit that like button too. What was the answer, Lee Chan Lee? That's uh, what they're asking. I don't know if anybody's gotten it right yet, so I, I can't comment. I can't comment yet because I just don't know. Alrighty, y'all. Man, this coffee's good. I, 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 bleh, bleh, bleh. I am going to have uh, probably one more coffee pour. As another salute to everybody on the Super Chat board um, here in a little while, as soon as I finish my first cup, there are more Jackbox games coming. Uh, so, <clears throat> we'll have another another coffee pour, so there's plenty of time, plenty of opportunity. Uh, let me just show you guys this. Then we'll get into these tickets. Now, we blessed these tickets good and proper. We did, we didn't. Every last one of these has been a, a dud so far. It's not the Psycho Ducky's fault, but it's the Australian Lottery's fault. <laughs> I blame it on them. We've had tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of fun. So, uh, Mrs. Amanda says she's going to be right back. Okie dokie. So, that's a lot of tickets right now. Um, I don't want to count it up right now. Maybe we'll count it up here in a little while. But uh, that means that we're due some winners. We're due some winners, guys. We're going to start off with this Cacatoos cash, though. We're going to start off with this Cacatoos cash. I'm going to zoom in as much as my camera will go. This is as low as I can get my camera, guys. Uh, it doesn't go any lower than this. <laughs> my check, one, two. Okay. <laughs> Scooper, who's talking to me? How the hell do you know everything about me? <laughs> oh, man. All right, the Cacatoos cash. This is an Australian lottery ticket. It is from Australia. It's a $1 ticket. And uh, the way that you play this, I'll, I'll stick it up here. Maybe you can see it a little bit better. But uh, the way that you play this is you scratch each game panel. <clears throat> games one through games three. Find the exact symbol three times in a game to win the corresponding price shown for that game. All right, the highest amount on this can be $10,000. Uh, Psycho Ducky, what coin should we use to scratch off this Australian lottery ticket? Because my corn on stream does not work on Australian lottery tickets, I don't believe. Cacatoos Cash has a prickly payout. That's right, Howard. That's right. In the words of Eddie Guerrero, I lied. I lied. Lied, cheat, and steal. Doreen Calhoun. Oh, my gosh. What are you doing? Doreen Calhoun, thank you so much. My goodness, thank you so much, Doreen. Truly, truly, unexpected, un, un, un everything. Thank you with the, the, the dollar signs. Oh my goodness, Doreen Calhoun. Doreen's awesome. She is. Uh, her and Cherry Berry as well, both of them uh, are, are truly, truly amazing people. Doreen, thank you so very much, so very much. Uh, for your generous donation. Uh, Psycho Ducky, did you, uh, uh, the 5, the 10, or the 20 is generally used? Well, let's go with, uh, I'm going with my Vegemite dollar. I'm going to go with the Vegemite dollar. That's right, guys. This dollar right here has a Vegemite can on it. Has a Vegemite can on it. That's pretty neat, huh? That's pretty neat. So, guys, let's go. Let's go. Let's scratch them off. Let's see what we can do. All right. The first symbol that we have uncovered is a hat. It's a hat. I'll get me hat. I'll get me hat. All right. So, I'll get me hat. Rock on. The next one we have is a... Uh, it looks like a broom or something. Well, well, so much for game one. So much for game one. What was the last symbol? What was the last symbol? The last symbol was a leaf. Uh, was ice cream really your favorite food? Oh, my. Oh, my. You want to uh, save some corn for Lee Chan Lee's tri trivia night? Oh, man. And check out Cherry Berry channel, uh, Cherry Berry's channel as well. There's a sun for the Sun City. Praise them. Praise the Sun City. Doreen says, that's where I left my broom. That's where I left my broom. Uh, and that is a, uh, a wheelbarrow. A wheelbarrow. Oh, well. Oh, well. No bueno on the second Puppy. game. There's a third son, though. Two out of three is uh, still not a winner, guys. We got game three. We got game three. What do we got on game three right here? What's the first one? It is a, a rainbow. Rainbows and unicorns for all of you. All of you get rainbows and unicorns. Why the hell not, right? We're all going to be happy. 
smiling people. Yes, we are. We're not going to let anybody bring us down. We're going to have ladybugs be revealed on lottery scratch off tickets. How many YouTuber Mondays in the house? I'll give you 100 corn. Well, I am featured on YouTuber Monday. However, I'm not a YouTuber Monday. I am not a YouTuber Monday. <laughs> Those are only on Lee Chan Lee Lee Chan Lee's channel. Now you gotta find out over there. Ah, uh, one more rainbow, guys. What could we have won on this? Well, we could have won the ten grand, and we could have won a thousand dollars, and we could have won three bucks. They didn't even want to give us three thinking dollars. I want an alpaca. Oh, an alpaca you want you. All right, let's move that over to the loser pile, guys. Let's uh, move our coin coin out of the way. Move our can of corn out of the way. We've got a little bit of a mess here. A little bit of a mess. we got to break out my favorite guy of the whole show, the true star. Lee Chan Lee says, hush your mouth. And Henry says, I am here to clean up all of your little lottery messes. Ah, ah, ah. I'm here to clean up all your little lottery messes. Henry sucks, man. Henry sucks. He's the vacuum with the most, guys. My co-host. Henry Vacuum! <laughs> suck it up, suck it up. No drama llamas in the house. What's up, what's up? Howard Matlock's still here, guys. Okay, so let's scratch off another ticket. Y'all wanted to see the battleship ticket. Let's go. Challenge accepted. Battleship. Here we are, guys. Battleship. It's a $5 Australian scratchy. It works just like the regular game Battleship. We're going to be playing with our $1 Australian coin here. And uh, it has Vegemite on the back. I think this is a dollar. Is this a dollar? Yes. All right. This is our $1 Australian coin. Maybe I should just scratch it with the Vegemite. <laughs> oh, I don't know. We've tried that once. It didn't work out so well. So, here we go, guys. We're going to keep our hashtag corn on stream on standby just for shits and giggles. But, it's battleship time, guys. Let's win a whole lot of Australian cash. What do you say? We need to get some theme music in here. I think we do. Oh, my goodness. All right, we're going to get my song in here. All right, nice and refreshing. Here we go, guys. Here we go. BGP scratches lottery tickets from Australia. Round two. Ready? Go. F5, like Brock Lesnar's finishing maneuver. The F5. Let's find the F5. There's F. One, two, three, four. F5. Is it a hit? Is it a miss? Is it a hit? Is it a miss? What's the first spot here? It's a... It's a hit, guys. First spot's a hit. We're off to the races. We're good to go. We're good to go. T4. Woohoo! Did you say battle shits? Yes, absolutely. Uh, can you have a school bell? Yeah, I'll find you a school bell. Absolutely, I will find you a school bell, Miss B Claw Brood. All right, next spot F5. Next spot is an H6. H6. Spot six. Row H all the way on the bottom. Is it a hit? Is it a hit? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. We got another hit, guys. Two for two. Scratching off number three. Shot number three has been fired. G1. G1. Let's see what we got in the G1 spot down here. That one appears to be a miss, guys. That one appears to be a miss. I know they have many bell rings on there. Yep. Yep, they have a ton of bells on there. They sure do. All right, next up. <clears throat> D5, like the Mighty Duckies. D5, like the Mighty Duckies, right? D5. Here we go. Guys, we got a hit. <clears throat> we got another hit. Sweet. A2. A2 right here on the top. Let's see if this is a hit. And it is, guys. We got hits all over the place. Got hits all over the place. Sean, you found the G spot? Congratulations. Congratulations, Doreen. I I'm happy for you. Good game. <laughs> Good game. Anyway, A2. We got it. E6. 
E6. E6. Here we go. E6. Right here. Right here. That's a hit, guys. That's a hit. No, no. No, is it? E5 we don't have yet. That's just some over over spray from the coin here. C4. <laughs> we got stuff. C4. One, two, three, four. C4 is not a hit. That's a blank, guys. C4 is a blank. Uh, there's no K2, right? Uh, K2. K2 what? Uh, no K2. I don't think so. No, no. Don't know what that is, but okay. Uh, G7. G7. Right down here in the corner. Who put G7 in the corner? Who put G7 in the corner? Did you do it? Ah, so I'm watching you. I'm watching you. H8 is after you, though, <laughs> apparently. H8 all the way further in the corner. So G7 put uh, H8 in the corner. That's what happened. G7 put H8 in the corner. Still winner, still in the room. Hello, hello. Nice to see you, sir. And Tarot and T with the Mrs. B. My real life wife, guys. Subscribe to her channel if you haven't. She does tarot reading. She does meditations. Uh, all kinds of stuff. Uh, B6, that's a great vitamin. That vitamin B6. I enjoy, I enjoy the B6. I do. And B12. Alright. Second row. Let's go. It must be fate. It must be fate. F8 is the row and the column. It must be fate. Well, apparently fate's a dud because uh, there was nothing there. A swing and a miss, a shot, and nobody was home. A5 on the top row. Is it gonna miss? Is it gonna hit? It's gonna hit. It hit something. Rock on, rock on. Okay, few spots left to go. Lots of shots. Lots of shots to go. Shot, 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 shots. B8. Roll the way over here. B8, B8, B8 is a blank. <clears throat> Cheryl Crawford's in the room. A whole bunch of people in here, guys. You guys are awesome. At the Stillwater Nation, rise and laugh, fall and giggle. <laughs> mm. Oh, F2. F2. What do we got? F2 right in here, y'all. That's a hit, guys. That's a hit. Of course, this ticket has been provided so graciously by the Psycho Ducky all the way down under in Australia. Like a D6. D6 right here. And it's a miss. And I timed this just right. Awesome. Everybody's awesome, including Strowtime, guys. Go check out his channel. Uh, he's doing some up, um, up, 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 upheaval. He's changing his channel around. Go check him out, though. It's still really awesome, guys. You won't be disappointed. One, two, three, four. Mm -hmm. All right. There's nothing there. Four spots left. Four spots left. Here's E5. E. E5. E5. Hey, is that a winner? Is that a winner? Is it E5 and E6? E5 and E6? I think we got a winner. I think we got a winner. That's 10 bucks. It doesn't matter what. We won. Hi, hi, hi! That's right, guys. See, that's all we needed. That's all we needed. That's a winner, right there. We still got three spots left too. Stro time with the 99 cents. Thank you, Stro time. You flexing on them, like that's the Stro flex right there. That's the Stro flex right there, right? Stro time! Stro time! Oh my goodness, hey, that's the first one I've won on. I think that's the first one I've won on. They got Stro time right up here in the top, guys. Thank you so much, Stro time. You guys are amazing. Okay, do we have another one? What's next? E8. All the way over here in the corner. E8. Strowtime Raid! Strowtime Raid! Strowtime's been off the air for quite some time uh, tonight. <laughs> but they're in the room now. 
V1 all the way over here. I doubt we're going to get anything else on here, but we're going to look anyway. We're going to look anyway. Here's an A3. A3. That right there, that right there, that E5 and E6, E6 right there, E5 right there. Amazing, amazing, amazing. We have won. How much is that in kangaroo cash? Um, hey Google. How much is $10 Australian money in US currency? About six dollars and eighty-one cents. About six dollars and eighty-one cents. We sunk the battleship. Uh, what did we sink? What did we sink? Uh, we sunk the. Uh, we sunk the destroyer. Is what we sunk. We sunk the destroyer. So yeah, man, Psycho Ducky one six eighty-one. He sure did. He sure did. We'll put this in our winter pile. And there's really not much lottery mess to clean up here, but we're going to get a clean playing field. We're going to break out the true star of the show again. Henry Vacuum one more time. Going to break out Henry Vacuum one more time. Then we're going to get back up top. We're going to play some more lottery games. Some more lottery games. Hey, give it up for Henry, guys. Scratch these off later. We'll scratch these off later. We are coming back to Jackbox right now. What's going on, Shane? How's it going, brother? Over here. Let's head back over here, guys. Let me move my screens back around so I can see all of your bright and shining faces. Because all of your faces are shiny. I don't know why they're shiny, but all of your faces are shiny today. It's just the way it is. More Jackbox games. What are we going to play? That's a good question. That's a good question. Uh, what we're going to play next? Uh, we got Joke Boat. Um, somebody wanted to play uh, a different game earlier that I saw. Uh, what was that other game that y'all wanted to play? Uh, been too quiet. Not many people on. Oh, no. Better than the kick in the butt. <laughs> Joke boat. Patently stupid. Yeah, that's what y'all wanted to play. Y'all wanted to play uh, patently stupid. So uh, let's play patently stupid. Keep in mind, guys, if you draw inappropriate stuff on my games, not only will you be banned from the game, you will also be banned from my channel and reported on Twitch. So uh, don't be silly. I mean, don't draw obscene things on my chat or else uh well you know i'll shake me nuts some more until i run out of nuts guys it is uncensored but guys uh, just don't make it too too terribly rude and crude guys uh let me get the settings adjusted so we can all play uh let's see post game yada 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 blah 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 extended timers okay 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 and i'm gonna bring the game in we're gonna get the game audio in and we're going to play a little bit of Patently Stupid, guys. Let me get logged in, and then you can all get logged in as well. If you want to, uh, go to jackbox.tv. Go to jackbox.tv, enter in the four-digit room code Jim. that I'm about I to give you. With Jim. I'm Jim. I give everybody the room code all at the same time, guys. Everybody gets the room code all at the same time. I'm about to put it up on the screen. Here, I'm going to press the button. It's going to show up in just a couple of seconds. So, guys, whenever... There it is. CRZS. CRZS. That's your room code, guys. We are playing patently stupid. This is when you come up with stupid ideas to market and sell to people. And you uh, get crowdfunding and all kinds of fun stuff. We got Scuba Man in the room. We got Cami777. We've got Lee Chan Lee 17 We've got five, three spots left. There's Arcade Arcade. Who else is in here? Cold we got Shane Anthony. M. What's up, Shane? How's it going, Shane? Nice to see you, man. Nice to see you. Part of the Gorilla Fan Bam. XX Random Somebody in there. Don't have a doodle, you doodle. <laughs> That's right. Cammy Blue on the move. All right, so who is this XX Rando person? That must be the random person in the stream that wanted to play this game. Okie dokie, guys. Room for one. Room for one. Come on in. It's so much fun, this room for one. Oh, where's J-Dog? J-Dog, party of one, where are you? We need you to play. We need you to play, J-Dog, party of one. Yep, that's random channel one. Our bakery is closing in 10 minutes. Please and it's also 10 o'clock. In the next five minutes. So, just at 10.01, we're going to start the game. We're going to start the game at 10.01, whether we're good to go or not. You've been wanting to play this game for so long. Well, now is the time, guys. At 10.01 p.m., whenever that happens, we're going to play the game. Patently stupid. You come up with silly inventions, guys. It's really fun, I promise. Cheers. We have room for a uh, room. 
We have time for another another coffee pour though. Real first. We'll have real first, right first. We'll have time for a coffee pour. Ladies and gentlemen, this, at this time a locally sourced Brazilian bean. We're gonna to take you. a toast. And we're gonna make a toast to all of the ones that have super chatted to the in the uh, in the chat this week. Uh, cheers to you, everybody. Time to refill the coffee. So if you have uh, super chat, super sticker, donated to the channel through the PayPal Streamlabs link, whatever you've done, here's to you guys. Mrs. Amanda, Carson Claus, Howard Matlock, Psycho Ducky, Sun City Scratchers, the V3, Deadpool, Rhino Scratches, Fantastic with the B-Clop Rude, Graced by God, Espresso Kathy Solo, teeth. Doreen Calhoun, Espresso Stro Time, teeth. you guys are awesome. Cheers to you. All right, Grist by God's in. Hello, Cameron, how are you? How are you, Cameron? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okie dokie, here we go, guys. Game's gonna start, here we go. I'm gonna disappear, listen to the short tutorial. Once again, cheers, guys. Cake donut for Sid. Cake donut for Sid. Hello, welcome to the seminar. My name is Toby, and this is my ex-wife, Lena. And together, we are about to change your lives. That's right, Lena. We've got a packed room of eight. But more importantly, this room is packed with future millionaires. Great. So now that the doors are securely locked, let's get down to brass tacks. How are we going to make you rich? Simple. By unlocking your potential. The potential to invent. And as Lena said, the doors are securely locked. Kicking them can only injure you. Now everybody knows the best inventions solve big problems. That's right, Lena. And to identify those big problems, we'll need to do something we call market research. Market On research. your device, you're going to receive two fill-in-the-blank prompts. Type in anything at all. And voila, you've created a problem. Now your created problems get sent to the other attendees to inspire their creative masterpieces. So let's get to it. Let's get to it. That's what they said. That's right, guys. You heard it. The game. You got to write up some market research questions. You got to do some fun things. It says fill in the blank. It gives you a card, and it says to fill in the blank. So you need get to, you need to, to fill in the blank. Hmm. Hmm. Digging the music, guys. Digging the music. Sweet. Here we go. Now look at your device. You've got somebody else's problems. Been there. Simply mm -hmm. pick the one you want to solve. Pick the problem that you want to solve. The one that you want to base your inventions off of. <laughs> Mic check, one, two. Boy, that felt good. That felt really good. No hurry, but that's half your time. Oh, that's half your time, guys. Fantastic. Now it's time to solve that problem. That's right. This is the pivotal moment where you bring your designs to life using nothing but a pen and paper. But we ran out of paper, so you'll have to use some cocktail napkins. Cocktail napkins. Mmm. Cocktail napkins. That looks and like don't toilet paper. To spice it up with a little color. A little bit of color. Spice up your drawing. All right. Now, here is what I have to do. Hmm. All right, so I have a problem here, and I'm trying to uh, to fix it, right? Trying to fix the problem.
All right, that's terrible. Woohoo! <laughs> okay, well, time. I guess we'll just, uh, I guess we'll just, uh, <laughs> present it as is. Remember, the house always wins, so change your name to the house. That's right. The house always wins. Change your name to the house. I like it. I like it. <laughs> oh, okay, a random channel is probably leaving after this. Well, I'm sorry that you have to go, but I am glad that you've been here, and I'm glad that you're playing the game. Uh, that you've wanted to play for so very long, as well as Lee Chan Lee and everybody else that's co-starring in this show right now by playing the games, you can actually join along in the audience if you would like to. You can go to jackbox.tv, enter in that room code CRZS. I was just gonna say that. Okay, so now let's bring it all home. Give it a title. And it's a free. Snazzy tagline. You'll come Something again soon. Think, hey, come again. I really Thank need you. Come that. again soon. Let's go. <laughs> Write a title and a tagline for your invention on your device. Okay, what's going on, Carson Claus? What's up, the man, the myth, the guy with the claw machine in his studio, Carson Claus? Howdy, 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 howdy. <laughs> oh, write a title for your invention. Um, hmm. Hmm. Mm -hmm. My uh, dyslexia is kicking in big time today. Oh my goodness. Morgan James is in the room. Cameron's in the room. Cheryl's in the room. James is in the room. Uh, Sun City Scratchers is in the room. Who else is in here? If you're in the uh, if you're in the chat, say hello, everybody. If you're in the chat, say hello to everybody. Want to take this time to Puppy. tell everybody here in the room that this is. Hold on a second here. Where did my thing go? Where did it go? Hmm. Ah, here it is. So, take a look in the upper right hand corner of the screen, guys. This is a broadcast aimed at TV 14 plus. If you are not 14 years of age, I do kindly ask that you find another broadcast to watch this evening, as this show is not for you. This show is made for adults over the age of 18 specifically, but I allow 15-year-olds and 14-year-olds in above in here. So, thank you for your cooperation, everybody. All right, random. Choose we it up. Got this covered. Hey, Tobes. Seems as if you have a problem. You bet I do, Lena. I'm struggling to grasp this. That is I'm having wrong. a hard time but grasping I think I air. Got just what you need. It's something I like to call. Oh yeah, that sounds the knife. Great, but sick. What does it look like? Mm. Glad you asked. Take a look at this. Picasso could have drawn it better himself. Great, Lena. But my check one line, too. I'm afraid I just won't remember it. Not to worry, my easily influenced friend. Soon every billboard will read this. So what do we have there? Really if it it it's helps you way. not die and That's breathe. Done, so it looks everybody. like it's a mask and a respirator thing where it filters your air. Okay, the not sick. I like it. Grace by God, what you got? <coughs> my check one two. Good night. Grace by God, you're up. I need an effective way to support this. I would like to support Tom Andrews. Solution. Just call it. I'm excited. With lovables. Let's oh my. Let's oh my, Grace by God. What do you have in mind? Nito. Big hearts. Big hearts. Then oh. take a gander here. And see. It's Tom Andrews. Dun dun dun. GG, <laughs> <laughs> Grace by God. Shane, you're up, buddy. What you got? I just need this. Need to get home fast. Well, I've got the next. I call it. My Swing on Manny. Kaboom! Three thousand. Like? Ready? Take a look. Ah, swing, swing. Where are you gonna land? Well, Bam. you're in luck. And scene. And scene. <laughs> I can't draw either, man. It's fine. Cammy, what you got, bub? Not that I don't love it here, but I wish I could always be Wish I could here. always be in well, that bar. Well, I got just huh. the thing. I'd like to call it... What's it look a like? A portable bar. Well, looky here. I like it. All right. Nice. 
Now just uh, wrap it up with a tagline. You just do that, and, and here's your and bar. Scene. Need a drink? Bring your own portable bar. All of your bottles are included. What the hell was that? No idea. No clue. <laughs> Oh, Arcade Arcade, you are up, I my friend. I miss being able to do this. Well, I've got a solution. It's called... I want to run like I used to. I mean, yay! Take a look. Walk see. assistance. Okay. You don't get that in Solar legs. legs. You know, with a tagline. Ooh, solar Let's legs. <sighs> and that's how it's Walk. done, everybody. Electronically supported. Nice. Nice. Lee Chan Lee, you're up, buddy. You wanted to play this game for a long time. Lee Chan Lee, here we go. I keep landing in jail for this. I stick my legs in the sun, this is Amanda around, says. But there's a solution. Keep it's getting arrested for stalking. Oh, Lee Chan Lee, that's unfortunate. You got my interest tingling. Maybe you should Take stalk the stalkers. Oh, look at Smart. that. And scene. It's the no stalk may stalker. It's the can of uh, stalk the stalkers. <laughs> oh, that's great. Scoop man. Break out the bubbly. Just Here comes the scuba will man. Do this to me anymore, and I really miss it. But he's gonna well, skydive with the scuba it. man no more. Like right. it. Hurt me up the skydiving well, machine. Look, I don't know what that is, but the skydiving machine. Machine. Now, see that the skydiving drawing. machine. That's what it is. Ready, Freddy? <laughs> oh, it just kind of like and pushes see. you out. Skydiving a tube without taking off. Hey, it's the indoor skydiving machine with the big ass fan on the bottom of it that pushes you up into the tunnel and the tube thing, and you you go around, your cheeks flap, and you look like a squirrel and, and all kinds of crazy shit. But here we go. It's my turn. I hate it when my feet smell. I do. So I've got the foot stank filter. That's right, guys. The foot stank filter. Um, unfortunately, our graphic designer was uh, terminated last week, and we have to deal with this new piece of garbage. But uh, that's a, a foot, I think, and that's supposed to be a filter for the foot stank filter. Um, and you know, filter your foot odor. That's just all there is to it. Filter your foot odor. That's it. I'm done. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Great job, everyone! Now, each of you has been given some money tokens. Give your largest chip to your favorite invention, your second largest to your second favorite, and so on. Got all that? Good. Let's go! Alrighty, yes, thank you so much, Sun City. I, I appreciate that, man. I do, I do, I do. Never, never feel bad about sending me one of those. Ever. <laughs> All right, so you got three tiers of investment for the foot stank filter, the portable bar, the skydiving machine, so the stalk the stalkers spray, the lovables, the hot dog on a stick. No, the, the not sick, not the hot dog on a stick. Who wants a hot dog on a stick? Free hot dogs and sticks for everybody in the digital format of PDF, I say. Free PDFs of hot dogs and sticks for everyone. Create your own. Ah, uh, say the sling uh, 3000 and the walk assistant solar legs. Oh, all right. So five hundred dollars. I'm gonna invest. Um, I'm gonna invest a lot of money in here. Hmm. I don't know. Let's see. Great. Now let's see which inventions drove people wild. You'll need which to acquire twelve hundred dollars in capital to not only fund your invention but also net yourself a five hundred dollar funding bonus. Invest in a successful invention and get double your money back. But if it fails, they keep your cash. Let's see how you did. How did you do? The portable bar I got 14, 1900. Ooh, way to go! Sweet, that was Cammy. Skydiving machine. Sorry, oh, it failed. You like the solar legs? It's pretty cool. I like the skydiving machine. So the not sick sad. did not make it. The not sick did not make it. Foot tank filter. Hey, that's surprising. Good Look job. at that. Look at that. Right on. Right on. Thank you. Thank you. Stalk this stalkers. Close, but no oh, secret. Sorry, Lee. Who got off work early? Was it your coworker? I bet it was your coworker, wasn't it? I bet it was your coworker, wasn't it? Well done. Let's see how you did, Lovables. You succeeded. Ah. Sling Omatic. Ooh, oh, a swing and a miss. A swing and a miss. A swing and a miss. Womp, womp, womp. Ha ching. That's all. Okay, for the final round, let's switch it up a bit. 
Instead of solving different problems, you'll all tackle the same problem. Dun dun dun! Dun dun dun! We're going to give you more money to invest, but now, there's a higher funding bar to clear. Good luck! Alright, higher funding bar. And the sure. honor of choosing that final problem goes to... You! Cammy! So select the problem you, you want everyone to solve. Is that you? It is you! Choose one of the problems that has been sent to your device, and we're all gonna solve it for you. We're just gonna be so much damn help, you're not gonna know what Ooh, to do with yourself. Good one. Okay, you know disgusted the drill. Disgusted by my dog's poop. Me too. It's kind of disgusting. Let's draw. Kind of disgusting. All right, if you're disgusted by your dog's poop, what should you get? Hmm. Mrs. B got off work early. Oh, I knew that. Rock on, rock on. Woohoo! Party in the USA. All right, so if you're sick of your dog's shit, what do you do? If you're sick of it, what do you do? What do you invent? What do you invent? I think I know what I will invent. I think I know what I will invent. We're halfway there. Oh, this is quite fun. Oh, this is quite fun. I'm enjoying myself. How much time do we have left? Oh, we got a little bit of time. I can continue to draw. Can continue to doodle. I'm doodling. Cleaning up dog shit. It's pretty fun. <laughs> Here we go, okay, Mrs. B got up work early. Rock on. Lines. Happy day. Invent something. Write a title for your invention. The Poopateer. That's nice, the psycho ducky. The Poopateer. Oh, yes. Okay, here we go. The Poopateer, the Psycho Ducky says. That's the Psycho the Ducky says the Poopateer. That's hilarious. What is the name of your invention? Anybody that's playing along in the chat? Anybody that wants to play along in the uh, audience in the game, you're more than welcome to as well. You can go to jackbox.tv, CRZS. Um, you know, that's kind of weird because, uh, you know, CRS is uh, actually the disease uh, you can't remember shit. CRS disease, can't remember shit, you know. So CRZS um, can't remember... Z? Z stuff? Cannot remember Z stuff? I don't know. What is it? What is your favorite? Uh, uh, bleh, bleh. Make up something for CRZ. Uh, Z right, this is your last in the chat to if you want to. So Cliff. Don't hold anything back. Oh, it's me. I'll present. I'm disgusted by dog poop. I am. So we have invented the crap collector. We have. See, the crab collector is a piranha plant on a stick. And uh, down there you have a, a nice steaming pile of poo. And what all you have to do, you have to grab onto it with your piranha plant on a stick, also known as the crab collector, and then you clean up that little stinky pile of poo. Clean that shit up! That's all you have to do. I'm done. Next. Congratulations, GG, everyone. <laughs> Lee Chan Lee, you're up, buddy. I'm disgusted by dog poo. Looks like a hulky Henry to you. You got a shovel. Ah, the shovel is your pooper scooper. Ah, the answer to all your shit. <laughs> That's hilarious. All right, grace by God, please choose an option on your device now. <laughs> Giggles like a schoolgirl. He said shit. Oh, 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 oh. I'm just so disgusted by this. There's well, your I'm warning. Solution. There's I'm your sign right over there. Let's There's your sign. Going. Take a look. You got the fishies? All it's missing is a tagline. Here it is. Got fishies? And that's how it's Never done, pick everybody. up poop again. You just kind of scoop it out, right? 
You just kind of scoop it out, though. Ah, that looked like a giant foam finger. <laughs> I'm just so disgusted Hello, kitty. by yeah. this. Well, I've got the fix. The dog all... poop's really getting on everybody's nerves, isn't it? Don't keep my eyes waiting. The poop Take burning 40. It's practically making love to my eyes. I'm freaking out. Give me that tagline. Oh, my. Here we go. And see. Just put your poop on the belt, and it gets caught on fire. You just put your poop down there. The conveyor belt brings it into the furnace, incinerating poop. And then it smells good somehow. It smells like patchouli and roses. I'm just so disgusted Leaving by Leaving that one this. alone. Yep. Well, I've got a plate full of fixings for you. Just call it. I gotta Boo see catcher. this. All right. Well, take a look, silly. Well, slap my butt oh. and call me Cornelius. Cornelius! Now slap a tagline on it. <laughs> Let's see it. Oh, Cornelius. And that's how it's done, Let the everybody. dog carry its own shit. Hey, there you go, man. Let the dog carry its own shit. <laughs> These are hilarious. I know. I'm loving it. I'm digging it. Shane M., you're up, buddy. Here we go, Shane. <sighs> I'm just so disgusted by this. So then disgusted. I've got something for you. I call it. Okay. The Velcro I'm poop hot. bag. Let me show you. Woo Ooh. A doggy I'll bag. Stick the landing with a tagline. Nice. Here it is. And Connect scene. it to your dog. It shits and cleans up after itself. I mean, it's like a built-in bidet for your dog's posterior. A built-in bidet for your dog's posterior. You know, I don't so know what this motion is, but this. this is a great well, motion. I've got a solution. It's a I'm wonderful motion. It. <laughs> automatic poop already. scoop. Well, looky here. Wow, we now similar show you that to the sweet, piranha plant on a stick. Well, you're Can you kill the dog? No. And this isn't see. Minecraft. <laughs> this isn't Minecraft. Why the hell would you want to kill a dog here? <laughs> oh. Random. What's up, Robo I'm just Shitsu. so disgusted by this. That's well, sumo I've in the woods. Well, I've just the thing. It's simply called... The Cliff. Artsy uh oh Take a gander. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's perfect. But I'll be angry if it doesn't have a great tagline. Ready, Freddy? Oh, no. And that's how it's done, Yeet the doggo off and it won't poop no more. <laughs> <laughs> that's actually hilarious. <laughs> That's actually now it's hilarious. Time to kick your favorites, but let's raise the stakes, oh, shall shit. we? We're going to give you more money to invest, but now there's a higher funding bar to clear. Good luck. Yeet your doggo off the cliff, off the cliff, off the cliff. Yeet your doggo off the cliff. <laughs> no more pooping. <laughs> oh no, I would never yeet a doggo off the fit, off the cliff. No, I think I'm going to go with the uh, the the automatic poop scoop and the the poop bag and then the 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 yeeting, the yeeting of the dog. <laughs> Simo can't wait till Monday. Oh, what's happening Monday? Is that when Simo comes back uh, from the woods and uh, 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 comes back and does a live stream? Maybe is that, is that gonna happen? Heather King's back. Hello, Heather King. So happy that you're here. Yes, sir. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Check out Simo's channel. Everybody here knows Simo. Way to go. Poop bag. You won. You got it. Sorry, Charlie. Mm. No Minecraft for you. Maybe next time. Maybe next time. Got fish. So sad. No yeeting. No yeeting. Oh well. We tried. We tried to yeet. We're unsuccessful yeeters. Nailed it. <laughs> Miss you guys. Mrs. Simo says hello to everyone, and she is feeling better. That's oh, awesome. Oh, too bad. Well, the poop scoop failed. Has anybody succeeded here? The diaper for dogs. Yeah. Rock on. The That's Velcro poop done. bag. The poop bags are succeeding. And the uh, the piranha plant on a stick. <laughs> the crab collector. That succeeded. Rock That's on. It. Cammy, Cammy, Cammy got 9,000, 9,000 in-game points. Now for some bad news. You might have missed the print on the flyer that grants us the rights to any and all inventions created here today. Yeah, it was on the back. Sorry. But thanks for making us rich. See ya. Thanks for making us rich. <laughs> oh, that was fun, man. Cammy, 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 give it up. Give it up for Cammy, Cammy. Cammy Blue's on the move. GG, everybody.
That's the way we roll around here. Double G's up in the chat. Gorilla Fam Fam is always rocking around here, guys. Live on the internet. It's five nights a week. Live on the internet, five nights a week, guys. 8.30 p.m. Central Standard Time, guys. You're not going to want to miss it. We play Jackbox games. We play Mario. We do all kinds of fun stuff. We uh, we actually have a battle royal to do. A battle royal? What the hell? Why are you going to do a battle royal? Well, because it's fun, guys. It's super fun, guys. A uh, battle royal is where you all um, get uh, abducted by aliens and stuff. Yeah. And we're back. Everybody's fighting it out for 500 corn right there at the bottom of your screen, guys. 500 corn. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Who's going to win it? Who's going to win it? There's a health pack right over there in the corner where James and I am. Cheryl's running away. I picked up the health pack. Now Scuba Man's going to town on Grace by God. Oh, there. Grace by God exploded. Arcade, Arcade. It looks like you are not doing... Oh, oh. You just exploded somebody back. See, girl is coming in. Oh, if I win, everybody wins. All right, guys, battle of a lifetime. Here we go. BGP versus Scuba Man. Scuba Man versus BGP. It was Scuba Man. That's the victor. Uh oh. Now let's try this. There we go. Scuba Man, congratulations, my friend. You have been the victor of the BGP Battle Royal. You did it. You did. That's awesome, dude. Oh man, Scuba Man, congratulations. Congratulations, Scuba Man. I gotta get you some corn. I gotta get you some corn. Well, you already got your 500 corn, but everybody in the chat is going to get 100 corn right now. 100 corn, guys, just for being here. Part of the Gorilla Fam Bam, guys. 100 corn just for being here. Part of the Gorilla Fam Bam. Because you guys are totally awesome. You guys are totally awesome. There's the Mama Sota. Hello, Mama Sota. How you doing, Mama Sota? How are you? How are you? Still PO rating for you, uh, V2. Okay. Okay. And uh, I would like to uh, let uh, everybody know that this, of course, is a broadcast intended for those ages 14 and over. We say dirty words around here that are not intended for younger viewers. And besides, you shouldn't have signed up for the platform if you're under 13 anyway. So, guys, it's been fun. But if you're under 13, it's time to say goodbye, guys. We're going to do some gambling right now. That's what we're going to do. We're going to do some gambling. We're going to be playing some lottery tickets. Let's head on over to Lottery Land, and I'll see you guys in a second. All right? All right. Alrighty, y'all. Here we are. Here we are. What's going on, Tham? How are you? How are you, Tham? I'm glad that you could make it tonight, dude. Glad that you could be here. We got some Australian lottery tickets to scratch off right now. We got some Australian lottery tickets to scratch off right now. So it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be real. Here we go. Here we go, guys. Let's uh We gotta do something here. We gotta get our screen our screen situated. There we go. All right, so we got some uh, Australian lottery tickets here, guys. We got three of them left right here. Three of them left right here. We've got the uh, the two dollar pearly riches. We have the two dollar uh, latte cash. The two dollar uh, latte cash. Let me zoom in just a little bit. Mic check. One, two. A little mini mic check there. The pearly riches right here, and a latte cash with the coffee on it. Then we have Monopoly. We have Monopoly. Oh my goodness, it's a big old Monopoly ticket. Oh, big old Monopoly ticket, y'all. These tickets, of course, are from the Psycho Ducky, guys. These tickets, are, of course, are from the Psycho Ducky. 
We have played Battleship earlier and we won $10 for the Psycho Ducky. $10 Australian, it's about $8 or $6 or whatever it was. You double tapped a deer today, you felt gangster. Oh my. Simo double tapped a deer, that could be interesting. Guys, we have our Australian money that we're going to be scratching with today, if I can find it. Ow. Where's my currency? There's my Vegemite coin. There's my Vegemite coin right now, guys. Let's figure out how you played this silly game. How you played this game? Um, you scratch the lucky symbols in your symbol panels. Exactly match three lucky symbols to any of your symbols to win the prize shown for your symbol. So that is awesome. Let's play, hoping for a speedy recovery. Stay positive, we love you. That is from Mrs. Amanda to the Mama Sota. <laughs> Hello, Simo, it's a Simo thing. Yep, guys, if you're going to, uh, if you're going to double tap a deer, just keep in mind that it's a Simo thing. If you're gonna double tap a deer, it's a Simo thing. <laughs> oh my goodness, hello, Mr. Mondo Man. Gorilla Fan Bam, what's up, dude? You have one of those Monopoly tickets? Awesome, awesome. We're gonna play this a latte latte. We're gonna find out what our lucky lattes are up here in these little milk jugs. What are our, our lucky symbols? We're scratching today with an Australian coin, the $1 Australian coin. This is a donut to go with our latte. And the next one is going to be some milk to go with our latte. And the next one is going to be a pretzel to go with your latte. Have you ever got have you ever had a pretzel with your latte? Funny, I was sleeping and I walked it, it walked up on me, you shot it in the neck and it fell so you shot it in the head twice and it was trying to get me. <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> oh, oh shit, just because I missed the potty panel. <laughs> just because you missed the potty panel. <laughs> oh shit, who cares man? It's YouTube. Winning symbols, here we go. What can we win? We can win up to uh, 25,000 Australian. There's our slice of the pie right there. There's our slice of the pie. You can barely see these tickets, man. You can barely see these tickets. Let's see if I can focus it up anymore. It's zoomed in all the way for the most part. Let me see. Oh, shit. There's language. Oh, shit. What happened? Hey, there we go. There we go. All right, so our piece of the pie. We have our piece of the pie. The next one is a pear. We're looking for milk. We're looking for donuts. We're looking for pretzels. Playing Australian lottery tickets, uh, courtesy of the Psycho Ducky, right here in the chat. This one is a croissant. <laughs> well, <laughs> okay, we're not saying the F words in here yet, but that's okay. Don't don't delete it or anything. That's fine, Simo. <laughs> um, yeah, we're, we're saying pretty much everything except for the F-bomb, but uh, we'll let that one roll. <laughs> yeah, no more pot, or no more PG around here, guys. We're, we're advertising to adults, damn it. All right, cherry for the cherry and the cherry berry, 48. Cherry for the cherry berry, but not on the, uh, not on the lucky numbers. Oh, we have a match. The milk and the milk. We have matched our milk. We have matched our milk. <laughs> oh, we have a milk match. Do we have any more? What's this? We have an ice cream cone. We have an ice cream cone. What else do we have? We've got a, a sandwich. We got a sandwich. Let's see. Uh, I know these days we should be able to say bitch. It's okay, I believe. Yeah, if you're referring to a female dog, and you're not referring to a person, then you can say the word bitch all day long. If you're referring to a bitch dog, so, yep, you're good to go. It is an American term. It's used by the American Kennel Club. I don't see why that's a problem. Just like saying ass and referring to a donkey. True. Now, we have a watermelon. A watermelon. Nope. Watermelons for Simo? Not a winner on this ticket, though. Not a winner on this ticket. What's next? What's next? A chocolate. A chocolate. Ah, uh, no chocolate. What's this? We have some candy. You got some candy? Okay. Candy, candy, candy. And what's this? We have a muffin. Do you know the muffin man? 
Do you know the Muffin Man? I don't know the Muffin Man. I used to be the Muffin Man, actually. I used to be the Muffin Man. I was the man that made all the muffins that we sold at the bakery. Last one is a strawberry, guys. Strawberry Fields, not so forever. Strawberry Fields, not so forever. That game sucks. Get that shit out of here. Let's play my favorite, uh, one of my favorite Australian lottery games, the Pretty Riches. We're going to change up the coins, too. We're going to change up the coins. We're going to go with this big 50-cent piece. We're going to go with this big 50-cent piece. That's what we're going to do. We'll keep our Vegemite coin over here to the side. But we're going to go with this big 50-cent piece. It's really neat. It's really neat. So, how do we play these games? Win that damn money. That's right. That's right. So, to play these games, we have to scratch all the lucky symbols and your lucky numbers, right? Exactly match any of the two lucky symbols to any of the eight your symbols to win the prize shown for your symbol. Alright, yeah, these tickets are really pretty. They're nice and sparkly. Really sparkly. You need a list Sunday evening, Howard. Okay. So we're going to find our lucky symbols right over here. What are our lucky symbols today? We have a dove, a dove, and a hat. A dove and a hat. I'll get me hat and I'll get me dove. Lee Chan Lee, joke, what do you call a 45 cent concert? Oh no, I don't know. Hello, Tiffy Barrel. Hello, hello, gorillas. Love you long time. All right, we're looking for a dove and a hat on here. Looking for a dove and a hat. See if we can find some doves and some hats. We have found a butterfly. Found a flutterby. And we have found a sun, El Sol. And let's see, next up. Next up, we have found perfume. Perfume, and I'm sorry that these guys are, uh, these tickets are so, uh, so small. Um, like here's a, a normal sized coaster, and uh, like it's just, I mean these tickets are, are very tiny. These tickets are very tiny. Just to show you. So perfume is not a winner. We have a diamond. A diamond! Claimers are everywhere! <laughs> Simo, you're killing me. What did Simo say? Did you say titty milk and a butt donut? I did. That's exactly what I said. Verbatim. <laughs> oh, what is this? We have a dress. No, dress not not very helpful. Not very helpful. What's this? There's a heart. So a dove and a hat and a heart. Nope. Anything else in here? Here is a, a flower. There's a flower. <laughs> Simo is a great listener. <laughs> well, I wasn't going to use that word either, but <laughs> let's, let's not use that word either. Let's, let's keep it to words that can refer to animals and ones that have been approved by YouTube. Like, uh, ass, shit, bitch, damn. Um, I don't know. <laughs> Nothing too highly offensive, but, you know. Well, is that everything? Is that everything? Did we just lose on another one? We'll scratch off the whole thing. We'll scratch off the whole thing. Just to see what we could have won. Oh, man, we've made a mess, but, yep, no winners on that one, unfortunately. Oh, bitch. <laughs> You're never offended. I'm usually never offended. You're trying uh, so many emotions in therapy, but I'm pushing through, Grace by God. Rock on. As long as he doesn't say semen. <laughs> With sailors. Mm. <laughs> mm -mm. Alright. Moving along. We've got Henry Vacuum. To clean up our little lottery messes, guys, let's move our Australian money out of the way. Make room for Henry Vacuum to do his job. Get him, Henry. Vacuum up all of our little lottery messes, guys. Give it up for Henry. Give it up for Henry. Isn't he great? Isn't Henry great, y'all? Henry and, uh... <laughs> ah. Guys, it's Henry and his attachment. <laughs> this is Henry and his attachment, everyone, cleaning up our little lottery messes.
Henry and his attachment. Oh, you guys are hilarious. You guys are awesome, guys. Uh, we have a Monopoly ticket, but I think I'm going to save the Monopoly ticket for tomorrow, maybe. I don't know. What do you guys think? Shut the front door. <laughs> Sounds like a good porno. <laughs> Act just had to take care of something painful done, but damn. Uh-oh. That's no good. Did <laughs> you get a titty? You get titty. Everyone get titty. You're crazy, Simo. You're crazy, dude. Oh, it's the Mama Sota! Rock on. So, what are we doing? Are we uh, are we doing Monopoly, or are we doing uh, one more Jackbox game and calling it a night? Henry needs a crown because he's King of Vacuums! Rock on. Uh, rock on. Uh, it's not like you're going to have a choice. Uh, is Mario going to be dropped for a higher rated game and things? Loving the new direction? You got this. Um, No, I'm not going to drop Mario. I'm not going to drop Mario. I'm actually going to go back over here. We're going to take a look at something. I'm going to come back over here for a second. We're going to have another uh, brief segment of... Um, hold on, if I can move my window. Where are you? Let me move my window back over here. We're going to have a brief segment of uh, uh, the, the other part of the program here. Just a very, very, very brief segment here. Let's uh, scoot back over here. And uh, guys, uh, this is a part of the program... This is a part of the program that's uh, titled Weird Shit. This is a type uh, part of the program called Weird Shit. So what are we going to do? We're going to talk about weird shit. Stuff that I've found on the internet. But uh, this isn't exactly weird shit. This is something uh, that's not really weird shit. This is, uh, this is the FCC or the FTC guidelines. This is the FTC guidelines, okay? This is from FTC.gov, the Federal Trade Commission, right there, okay? All right, so here we go. They have released new things, and I do want to tell you guys right now, look, look right here. This was published today, 11-22-2019 at 12.56 p.m. their time, right? Serious shit, yeah. We'll talk about some serious shit for a minute. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to give you a brief overcap of what this thing says right here. Okay? How channel owners can determine if their content is directed to children. Keep in mind, this is coming directly from the FTC. I am quoting them and their words. Under COPA, there is no one-size-fits-all answer about what makes a site directed to children, but we can offer some guidance. To be clear, your content isn't considered directed to children just because some children may see it. However, if your intended audience is children or is kids under 13, you're covered by COPA and have to honor the rules requirement. The rule set the rule sets out additional factors the FTC will consider in determining whether your content is child directed. Bullet point one, the subject matter. Bullet point two, visual content. Bullet point three, the use of animated characters or child oriented activities and incentives. Number four, the kind of music or other audio content. Five, the age of the model. Six, the presence of the child celebrities or celebrities who appear to be children. Seven, language or other characteristics of the site. Eight, whether advertising that promotes or appears in child directed at children. Nine, competent and reliable empirical evidence about the age of the audience. Okay, this is the shit I want to talk about. This is the shit I want to talk about. Okay, that quote right there. Competent and reliable empirical evidence about the age of your audience. That right there is the one that I want to talk about. I have competent and imperial data supporting that my show is broadcast to people over the age of 13. Specifically, most of you guys fall in between 25 and 60. Most of you guys fall between 25 and 60, so that is the major regulation right there. So, guys, I have got all the imperial evidence, imperial evidence, uh, whatever, the empirical evidence I want. And then also we've got uh, the determination of whether your content is child uh, direct will be clearer in some contexts than others, but we can share some general rules of thumb. Uh, first, unless you are affirmatively targeting kids, there are many subject matter categories where you don't have to worry about COPA. For example, if your videos are traditionally adult activities like employment, 
finances, politics, home ownership, home improvement, or travel, you're probably not covered unless your content is geared towards kids. The same would be true if your videos are aimed at high school or college students. On the other hand, if your content includes traditional children's pastimes or activities, it may be child directed. For example, the FTC recently determined that an online dress-up game was child directed. Now second, just because your video has bright colors or animated characters doesn't mean you're automatically covered by COPA. While animated shows are directed to kids, the FTC recognizes there can be animated programming that appeals to everybody. It's right here. It's highlighted on the screen. The FTC recognizes there can be animated programming that appeals to everyone. I'm not starting an opinion war here i am stating exactly what it says on the ftc website so guys this has been today's episode or today's segment of weird shit now i think we're gonna do something else and uh let's see tiffy bell what did you say so like my channel statistics show my videos are mostly watched by people 25 to 32 so even though i do pop culture content does that mean i should be okay um, to be perfectly honest with you, I, I don't feel comfortable telling you if your channel is going to be okay or not. Um, that's something that only you can determine. But what I can do for you, what I can do for you, I'm going to put this link in the chat right now. That's not the link. That's not the link. That's not the link. This is the link. Alright? That's the link right there, guys. So if you want to go and read the policy for yourself, please feel free. Go over, read the policy, make the decision for yourself, guys. That is why the information is out there. There's been a whole shit storm of stuff going around on YouTube, and this is the major part of it. It's the flavor of the week. It's rap battle time, guys. That's exactly what it is. It's rap battle time, so we're going to fire up the game it's going to be fun. Let's turn that off. Let's get that back on. We're going to fire up the, ja the, the game here. We're going to play some rap battle, guys. It's going to be the last one of the night. That's not a sausage link. Shane summoned me back. Well, look, the turkey ass <laughs> time is here. Uh, let's see. Ventriloquism and YouTuber Mondays. Rock on, rock on. It's a roll of the dice. It is a roll of the dice. It is. It is absolutely a roll of the dice. But, uh, uh, you know, there's there's a few things that uh, need to be taken into consideration. And like I said, you know your channel more than uh, more than I do. And it's up to you to make your determinations. Um, I am closely following... Um, I'm closely following a number of channels, including... Including uh, some of the biggest Mario content makers on YouTube. And uh, I'm pretty much following their footsteps. And uh, what they're doing is... Uh, to be determined, because we still have time. This law could change. It could change. Everything is May. Yep, May, May, May. Everything is May. It's still, um, it's still out there. Like I said, I'm not gonna get into an opinion thing. Um, that was just stating the facts. Um, so you know, take it how you will. Take it how you will, guys. Uh, we're gonna be playing some rap battle. I'm getting it uh, loaded up right now. Get making sure everything's in here. Um. So, all right, good to go there, and I'm going to get logged into the room, and you can get logged into the room, and we can all play together. Let me, oh, this is a good room code. This is a good room code. I like this room code. All right, guys, if you're ready to play the rap battle game, they sound like pedophiles, okay? Very nice, you got it right. Okay, 100% uh, uh, FTC finger that <laughs> Didn't we say not to say that word, Simo? Didn't we say that word? <laughs> As I said, it answers jack shit. Yep, so much shit's going on. Uh, I had a weird shit once. Okay, we're all we're all using the word shit. All right, that's great. Okay, um, the still winter nation. Yep, thanks for let's gonna delete a few videos. I will not now. Thank you. Very nice. Uh, like I said, this is not advice from me. This is not advice. Here's your room code, guys. Epus. E pus. Come on in, join the room. We're gonna play some rap battle tonight. Like I said, I'm not giving out channel advice. I am simply stating what the FTC has written on their website for you to make informed decisions for yourself, guys. Um, uh, I read the, the thought the same thing. Okay, uh, .gov. Oh, God, okay. Gotta fix dinner, bitch. <laughs> Go fix my dinner, bitch. 
<laughs> You're crazy. Uh, yes, honestly, uh, see, Stroh Time says, honestly, I think they'll channel uh, uh, bigger, or target bigger channels. I think so, too. And I also want to take into, I want to talk about one more thing that I, 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 I heard. I don't know, um, I'm going to call it, pause this for a second. I'll bring in the game audio. But, um, an e-puss. Yes, an e-puss. Um, <laughs> that's the room code. Um, I read someplace, and I have to find the source. Um, I have to find the source again. But I read someplace that the, the size of the fine may, again, there, there, there's that word, may, that word may, the size of the fine may depend on the equity of the channel. So the equity of my channel is, I mean, way less, way, way, way less than, say, $500. So, you know, even if I get popped, I'm more than likely it's not going to be a $42,000 fine. More than likely, it may be. Stro said it right. You're gambling. You're taking a risk. But we'll see what happens when the regs actually come in and, uh, you know, they start actually doing stuff. Game audio is pumped in right now. we got a full room. Sit back, relax. Grab your popcorn, guys. We're going to play some games. Rap battles coming at you. Who's in the room? Co-stars for this game are Cammy, Strotime, Goofy, Tham, Shane, Arcade, Lee Chan Lee, guys. I'm going to disappear. Listen to the tutorial. Here we go. Doors open in three, two, one. know who it is, Shadow Master MC, and tonight we got a lot of different styles of MCs in here. Okay, it's your turn, Rach. I gotta figure out what's going on with all these robots. Alright, I can do this. Here's how you do it. We'll ask you for a word or a phrase. We'll use it to complete line one of your rap. You then write a line that rhymes with it. We do that about two times and you have your four line verse. We hear him back, and we vote on that winner, which, honestly, you all are. Hey, Shadow's back. Thanks for nothing. We doing this. Robots are no robots. All right, hip-hop heads, are you ready? I can't hear that. I said, are you ready? Cool, cool. Let's get it in. Time to write. Get them lyrics together. Write a word or a phrase, then an entire line that rhymes with the one that we give back to you. Now you gotta do that twice, all right? Hit that suggestion button if you need it. Paging Dr. Ducky. Dr. Ducky, we're going to need you in the burn unit, please. Dr. Ducky to the burn unit, your services are needed. Burn gel on standby. All right, guys, this is the rap battle game. This is what we go. They're working overtime on this issue right now. Rock on. Fantastic Wit, I have a question for you. Actually, you, you may or you may not know the answer, but I do want to pose this question to everybody, really, in the chat. So, Let's say that, and I don't, but let's say that I worked for YouTube, right? Let's say that I worked for YouTube and I was over the department, over a department, that when you submit a manual review for uh, reviewing for monetization, if you worked in that department, don't you think that as a boss, I would implement a policy that every time you reviewed a video for monetization, you should also review that video for children's content and flag it as such? That's a serious, easy fix. Put the training in place, and then just take care of two birds with one stone all the time. It works for me, but I don't know. This is Google that we're talking about, so who the hell knows? Who the hell knows? That's just me thinking like a manager, I guess. I don't know. Let me get down to the game here. Um... Squirrel! Yep. James says yes. Google Man says yes. Amanda says yes. Uh, Jamie Blanco, FTC, hasn't ever used clear language, though, so it would be tough. I agree. I agree, Jamie Blanco, and welcome to the show. Glad you could make it. Welcome, welcome, welcome. My name's Sean, and I like to stream live games on the internet five nights a week. Uh, let's see. Got half of your writing done? Because you should. Hmm. Hmm. 
Now, if you can't think of anything at all, you can use that right for me button. Alright, got mine locked in. Cool. Alright, so let's see. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. You and me both, but I'm lucky if I can get one night in. What happened? Oh, rock on, dude. Oh, yeah, about streaming five nights a week. Yeah, man, uh, I got it uh, five nights a week, uh, 8.30 Central Standard Time. Jackbox, Mario, all adult content, 14 and over. Damn it. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Come on, let's do this. All right, you got to hit those voting buttons. Let us know if it's whack or dope. Oh, thank you so much, Jamie. I appreciate that, man. Showtime, what you got? Google me, you'll see a picture of a big ass mountain. Bigger than the ego that's attached to my big ass fountain. Wave your hands in the air like you just don't flex. Then come watch Stro Time pop these pecs. Ayo, popping pecs, Stro Time, man. <laughs> alright, alright. I see what you work GG, with. man. You know you gotta answer that. Put some weights on them muscles and get them words out. Man, Stro Flex. Goofy. I come and see and conquer just like Jack the Ripper. That's because my raps are so brutal. Ouch! Ouch! I got underwear that's sprayed with gold. Gold underwear! Because all my raps go platinum. Platinum! <laughs> Alright, okay, Goofy. That's Doreen right. Calhoun go. in the chat, man. Now let's keep it moving. <laughs> Alright, y'all. GG! Put it in happen. your votes, y'all. Make it happen, Captain. Put in your votes. Toot toot, we got a scoop! Toot toot, we got a scoop! <laughs> Come on in, guys. Ninja hugs for everybody. You guys are awesome. Is it going to be Goofy or Stro, man? Is it Goofy or is it going to be the Stro Flex? Stro Flex. <laughs> Doreen, six votes in. Stro time, man. You got it, dude. Rock on. Double G's up in the chat. That's what we roll around this guy, around this channel. Good job. Time Good for job. coffee. Congratulate. Hey, Cheers. watch your feet, dude. Watch That's your feet, dude. the biggest toe i ever seen in my life. I need my next two MCs to step up here. You ready to go? All right. Lee Chan Lee and Shane. Let's go. I've learned the ancient secrets of the Damascus. Stro Time was the leader of the masses. Uh oh, 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 damn. Trying to catch me is a wild goose fart. Unlike you who lives in Walmart. <laughs> damn. Shane's coming in right. hot, bro. Appreciate you. Ooh, you gotta respond to that. Oh. First things first, I'm better than gaming. When you lose this battle, your eyes will be flaming. <laughs> my brain's so big, my head's about to crack. What? You can't diss me because I own you in this track. Meet you and Lee coming in. Hot right, dude. Let's keep moving. Damn for us. Let's get those votes in. <laughs> oh, snap. Oh, snap. That's a hard one. Will would you up, guys? You know how we roll. You know how we roll. Give it up for the co-stars of the show, Shane and Lee Chan Lee. Oh my vote. goodness. Oh my goodness. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I gotta give it up for my favorite one. Dragged him back to take shots. <laughs> That's the way it should be right there. That's the way it should be right there. Fitty fitty. We'll be back shortly. I responded above and you can let me know your thoughts, Sean. Uh, once I can type in All chat right, again. Okay, robots, I will look let's up. Go. I feed my rhymes, I drink the blood of a monkey. Oh! You just donk like a freaking donkey. You just donk like a donkey. <laughs> I'm slam dunking rhymes like a tennis ball. <laughs> Writing all sorts of whack shit on the wall. Nice, arcade, arcade. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Double <laughs> G's up, GG. <laughs> woo, woo. Now it's your turn. Let's get it in. I can't get over me. I'm like a case of diabetes. Sweet like Snickers, but it'll bring you to your knees. I taste sweet as a delicious payday. It's hot. You got food off the stage. Hey, mate. Good day. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ouch. Ouch, look at that robot. You got slammed, bro. You got slammed. So start clicking that button. <laughs> Oh, is it me or is it Arcade Arcade? Is it me or is it Arcade Arcade? Psycho Ducky, light blinks green. Keep your hands and feet together whilst being on the slide. 50-50, go to the backseat, Gorilla. And I got the cheer bonus. Good game, good game, dude. Rock on, that was fun. You know what it is, it's the next matchup. Cameron and Tham. What's up, guys? 
Don't look now, I stole your itchy. Feeling kind of glitchy. <laughs> I'm not much of a snitchy banker. <laughs> snitchy banker. Always grabbing my wanker. <laughs> oh my goodness, Sam. Oh my god. Right, Sam's right, grabbing right, his right. wanker. How dare right, he? We gotta move on. How dare you? Oh, you? shake me nuts. Oh, shake me nuts. I'm stirring up beats with my big old spoon. How about you play me a tune? I'm a killer with a heart of scots. Heart of scots? Don't forget to change your socks. Don't forget to change your socks, man. Them stinky socks. That was okay. Show arcades in the room, one in the slot machines. Well, now officially over. Over. Use your devices and figure out who it is that was the dopest MC. That's right, guys. Is it Tham or is it Cammy? Is it Tham or is it Cammy? It's my coffee, is what it is. Sam in the crusty sock. Mm. All right, Sam's World, Cameron 777. Sam's the winner. GG. GG, my job, friend. Y'all, good job. Let's check the scores. Shall we? Let's check the scores. All right, it's throw time, then Sam, then me. The rest of you, fourth through eighth. Round two. All right, y'all, writing time. Follow the instructions on your device. Round two, here we go. Hmm. All right, writing rhymes. It's a rap battle game. We're robots. We're battling it out. You guys can join in on the audience if you want to by going to jackbox.tv. The room code is EPUS. 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 Or Epus, if you like, or, or however you would like to pronounce it. EPUS is the room code. You can join in. We're going to destroy buildings in the background. We're going to call trains. I'm going to write jokes and, and rhymes. So. against Stam. I'm going up against Stam in a rap battle. We got a little bit less than two minutes to go, and I got to figure out what I'm going to write against this rap battle with Stam's world. Hmm. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. What can I put in here? Oh no, the psycho ducky guy shot straight through the skull by one of the security guards. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, sorry psycho ducky. Burn cream on standby for everyone. Burn cream on standby for everyone. Um... Got mine locked in here. All right, what are we doing? We're destroying another building. Uh, is it the puppy hospital? Uh, everybody destroy the puppy hospital. Here we go, round two. That's right, guys. Here we go, round two. Oh, I'm looking forward to it. Here comes the building, and we're gonna get it. Are we gonna get it? Here it goes, there it goes. Oh, look at the building crash. Look at the building crash. Pew, pew. Boss up if you want to, guys. Boss up if you want to. Bang boss in the chat. Bang boss in the chat if you want to. Feel free. Put a little pepper on it. Toasty! Toasty! Here's the undercard and main event for round two. Somebody better come get this money. You ready for this? Let's get it in. Shane. Your skills are close, but no cream pie. Yes, yes. Most ladies say I give them a natural high. <laughs> I'll eat you for breakfast with my bacon wet. <laughs> the ladies love it, the ones I've met. <laughs> Shane! Oh my god! <laughs> alright, alright, you heard that. Let's keep it moving. Rock on, dude. Grab the mic right and get on. busy. Right on. 
GG. Ever hear the one about the weak ass pathetic? He hangs out in your attic. I'm so clean. You're as dirty as your fire poker. What a stinky joker. <laughs> what a stinky joker. Wow, nice <laughs> game. GG, y'all. GG, put them in the chat. You know how I roll. Use your devices to vote. <laughs> Mic check one, two. I'll give it up for Shane. Oh my goodness. That was great. Shane, Shane, Shane versus Shammy. Who won? Six votes in. One to five. Oh, Shane got it. And our winner is Shane. Where my you. two MCs at? Let's go. Arcade and Goofy. Here we go, guys. I got the map. My face and your ass. <laughs> You can't beat my ass at this game. <laughs> this will be over before you can belch. Uh, you just got beat by a girl check. who just beat her ass. <gasps> Doreen is kicking ass and taking names around here. That's cool. Woo wee! Right, wow. Ready. Arcade? You're going nowhere, so why are you wearing a spotted arty top? Just rock on and party, then die. <laughs> Freight trains coming right at you like. Woohoo! Woohoo! The freight train yeah, coming over her face and his ass. Just keep it moving. Yeah, check it your out. face, nice your ass. Your what's the difference? Eh, what's the difference? Your face, your ass. Oh, is it goofy or is it arcade? Put your votes in, guys. Party till we die. All right, so with the uh, answer to your question earlier, um, or my reaction to your statement, um, who do I trust more? You know what you're doing. Um, you know how you're doing, and it's done. You won. Next two robot battlers. Let's get it in. I don't know, really. Go time. Your face is my ball, my words are my hammer. You puppets have their hands up your whammer. <laughs> Better speak up. You're quiet as a mouse. Before I left, someone gets Emo out my mother loving house. <laughs> someone gets Emo out my mother loving all house. Right, all right, thank you, thank you. Now we gotta move on. Let's That's go, awesome. Go that is awesome, dude. Oh, you I thought it said that we could boss deep up. Deep you know, I fight I, just I, like Rocky, but you lost like Creed. Keep your head, don't lose your grab. Looks like you will retire because muscles are now flat. <laughs> oh, you're not. Big. Oh, that's good. That's right. good, Lee Chan Lee. Lee Chan Lee. Okay, you should have done. Who's the yeah. dopest rapper? Who's the wackest cat? Yeah, you know, that's the weird thing, guys. Like, I don't want to drop the f bomb. But I don't mind you saying the word fecking, like you got an Irish accent, like the word, um, uh, uh, what's that movie, um, uh, that movie, uh, fecking movie, Spook. yeah, showtime, you got it, yeah, Mrs. Brown's boys, and the fecking Mrs. Brown's okay, boys, good job, good and if the job, caption picks up on it, whatever, I've been hey, live man, for three hours, fuck it, step. <laughs> right? Next match. <laughs> Next e plus. <laughs> this is the room code. Damn and Baxi. Here we go. You're nothing to me like a little nut. You'll make more money shaking like a slut. Bet she never heard about the birds and rabbits. Have you heard about me winning? It's just one of my habits. It's just one of my habits. Have you heard about the birds and the rabbits? Wasn't the best I heard. Everybody the gonna thing. have a All good right, time. time. Damn world. You look familiar like an odd shaped broken balls. Don't mess with me cause into dolls. I don't got pity but I can give you a shot he'll pick you up. Just hit this crap and STF you. Oh no! Hit this crap and shut the front right. door. <laughs> oh damn! Are we seeing a theme? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> Who's it gonna be guys? BGP or Thams World? BGP or Thams World. GG's, that's the way we roll, guys. That's the way we roll, roll around this chat. Good heckin' game. That's what that means. Good heckin' game. The backseat girl is taking the points on that one, guys. This is B. Tarot T. This is B. Got your winner. Let's move on, y'all. <laughs> Looks like YouTuber okay, Monday is officially Let's removed Stro time. One more round left. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Scores. Let's check out the numbers. Let's see who winning this right now. <laughs> All right. So, Stro time. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. 
You know the drill. It's the same thing Stro. as round two. All right, Stro. Here we go. Here we go. What? <laughs> Here we go, Stro. Oh, for guys that don't know, me and Stro are battling it out now. We're battling it out now. Here we go. All right. Has the adopt bot, adopt a bot been shown? I don't know what the adopt a bot is. Love bot. Hmm. Oh, the billboard. Eye mattress. Start counting electric sheep. <laughs> oh, whoop his ass. <laughs> whoop his ass at BGP. <laughs> oh, man. Let's see. Let's see. Mark Twain said a man who carries a cat by the tail learns something he can learn in no other way. It's very true. It's very true. I'll take that back. Love a bot unless it's Nightbot. Then it's a dumbass. You know, I like the algorithm uh, fair enough because it's going to pick up on the words that I say. It's going to pick up on the, the words on the screen. Hey, but, you know, if it's going to manually yeah. review it, you know, well, I don't know. If, if it is done by a human, I think there needs to be a better way of reporting it. That's it. A no. Wow, Let's see. you are so observing. All righty then. Very funny, Rach. Nice sarcasm. Okay, I get it. Yeah, you do. Can't think anything. You can choose right for me, but you might not like what we give you. Mm -hmm. You better get them fingers moving. All right, locked in. Locked in. Here we go. Deadpool. What's up, dude? Deadpool's in the house. No. No. Wow, Chubby's is in here too. Mrs. Backseat. You ready? Let me see it. Have a good night, it. Mrs. Amanda. Now, let me hear you Have a wonderful spit evening, it. Mrs. Amanda. Thanks for stopping in, man. You look like you came from a botched lap band. <laughs> I can't see your only fan. Oh! Oh! I'll keep this short like your ass. <laughs> I hope I don't rhyme too fast. <laughs> oh, internet wifey! What's up? What's up? I was okay. <laughs> Gammy Blue! What gonna say after that? GG. Have a good ass night, Mrs. Amanda. Last night in bed, your mom told me you were stupid. <laughs> your daddy's compom broke and mine was unprotected. Well then! <laughs> That's what you have to say? Well, kiss my bacon. <laughs> because your mama said, hey boo, what's shaking? <laughs> oh, we <Lee> changed <Jamie. laughs> This is fun. <laughs> Y'all are terrible. Y'all have some terrible, terrible things to say to each other. Oh, how dare you say these terrible like things to each in. other? Wow, y'all are brutal. <laughs> the Cammy or Lee Shan Lee. Double G's up in the chat. That's the way we roll. James Gerhardt, hello, hello. Cubbies is still in here. Saw your better half earlier. Is she still around? Yours is worse. Much love, Deadpool. We're playing uncensored rap battles, dude. Uh, but y'all hella each other. Hella love each other. <laughs> oh, Lee Chan Lee, man. Rock on, dude. Congratulations. We got our winner. Now it's time for the next couple of MCs to get down. Dance world, party time, arcade, arcade. Me and you're gonna get negotiated. Ooh. 
and if the price is right valued and appreciated. Step off before I hook up with your grandpa. Uh-oh. We would live a happy life in Florida, Tampa. <laughs> We're gonna live a happy life in Tampa, Florida right, with your grandpa. Thanks. Now we gotta That's move right. On. Next MC. She went to TikTok and should be back. <laughs> I've seen better faces on wood. But it's but it's but it's but it's but it's <laughs> Listen now and shut your nostril. I've got my mind on my money and hope this rhymes. I got my mind on my money and I hope this rhymes. Okay. <laughs> Rock on. Cool. Show time. Now, let's okay. keep it moving. <laughs> All right. It was I a blast. Sorry, I didn't finish. Just didn't feel it was appropriate. It oh, it's all good, man. Slave. Sometimes you have to know where to draw the line, and if that's where you had to draw the line, then that's perfectly fine. That's why you have choices, decisions. You know. Good game. Double G's up to both of you guys, Sam and Arcade Arcade. Yeah, I would much rather you know stop right in the tracks and let the game decide for you than and put out something that's potentially like way inappropriate. You know. You know, we don't deal with things like racism and bigotry. We have that in the rules. So, you know, and, you know, some F-bombs are somewhat appropriate and some of them aren't. It's just all about context. So, we're good. You'll get me next time. Rock on. Well, mine wasn't too bad either, man. I didn't I didn't take it hard. I didn't take it hard. Arcade and bam! And now we got our win. Nice job, kiddo. Now my next two battlers are up and they ready to roll. Shane and Goofy, here we go. Oh no! My words just pooped all over you. Oh no! If you were dying of thirst, I wouldn't give you a milkshake. No milkshake just for you. Just like the song, I bring all the boys to the yard. <laughs> no milkshake for you. Yo, <laughs> no milkshake for you. No milkshake for you. You go down in one hit. Ah. I took one look at his wanker and bar. Oh no! If I saw you online, I would swipe down. I saw strove tighty whities and saw something brown. <laughs> Shane oh, M bringing right. it hardcore. Keep oh it. my god, you the can't be rude over. anymore? Why well, can't you be rude anymore? Vote. Uh, it, yeah, it does, choose the, it does choose the subject. It does choose the subject. This is fun, man. Good game, both of you guys. Uh, Shane and uh, Goofy. Shane and Goofy. It's Let's in the rules. In expeditiously. You can't be rude anymore? What do you mean? Spamming, asking for real names and or personal info, trying to get laid, trolling, rudeness. Oh, uh, you, okay, maybe I do need to take the rudeness out. You just can't be rude to people. You need to be respectful to people. But, you know, you know how it is. <laughs> trying to get laid, into bed, <laughs> to rest. <laughs> GG! Shane, dude. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, there's your winner. We can't try to get laid. Who's the best no. of the best, y'all? Time to see who's really number one. <laughs> Me and Stro, here we go. I'm cooking up eyes that'll make you weep. I write better lines during my beauty sleep. I can't hear what you say, I'm deaf to warts. Hope you had fun, now salute my shorts. <laughs> <laughs> salute me shorts! Okay. Salute All me right. shorts! That's cool. Yes, Mrs. B is great in bed. She can stay there for days. Bed. <laughs> on your knees before I get crazy. Off your ass, f you, pay me. Uh oh. Your mom is so dumb she says rat rhymes with ass. <laughs> That's out of line. I'm not gonna finish. You win. <laughs> oh, it's all right, Stro. I understand where you're going, man. These games aren't gonna offend me, but uh, I do appreciate that, man. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Vote to see who was the dopest. Appreciate it, dude. Rock on, dude. Rock on, man. All right, stroke time for me. Stroke time is me. I just got laid in the buttocks by this rap battle. I love you too, brother. I do. I do. I do, man. Good game. Good game. I don't know if I even wrote that in there. I don't even know if I wrote that in there. But yeah, this is all fun and games, guys. Literally. This is all fun and games. We're here to have fun. We're here to uh, build each other up, not to break each other down. If we didn't like each other, if we weren't friends, then honestly, I wouldn't allow y'all to play these games and beat up on each other like this. Because, you know, I want to have a positive adult friendly community here guys and this is just one of those games it happens don't take it personally yeah positivity being positivity yep respect everybody it's show time rock on brother rock on dude congratulations you got that one now we gotta see who won let's see who won yeah real friends beat up on each other in real life 
Shane Shadow Master is out. Ain't no room or space for this up in here. Peace. You got it, Shane. Congratulations, Shane. Congratulations, bro. Congratulations. Oh, this is a great game, dude. This is a great game. Grace back on says congratulations. I say congratulations. I sure do. Guys, you know what happens every now and then. Every now and then we have a battle royal in the game or in the chat here. That's right, guys. Every now and then we have a battle royal. We sure do, and that is one of those times right now. So, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to start the Battle Royal, and I'm going to see you guys in just a few moments. All right, all right. Y'all better fight for the corn. 500 of it. Kill everybody in the game. I see that Joe Arcade has wins. Joe Arcade wins. Has won. Joe Arcade wins. Has won. It's true. He has won. Congratulations, Joe Arcade wins. You got 500 corn, man. You got 500 corn and everybody in the chat, guys. I'm feeling extra generous right now. Feeling extra generous right now. You're all going to get 150 corn. Just for the hell of it. 150 corn goes to all of you. Good game. Good game. Hey, Flo, glad you're still in here, man. Glad you're still in here, y'all. Everybody in here. We're going to scratch off one more lottery ticket, I do believe, guys. We're going to scratch off one more lottery ticket. What do you say? We're going to hit that Monopoly lottery ticket for a shit ton of money. We're going to do that? I think so. What in the effing got my ass beat by a toilet booth or a phone booth? <laughs> yeah, it's a, uh, it's a TARDIS. That phone booth is floating around down there. It's a TARDIS. In fact, let me go pick up the TARDIS. Uh, who wants a phone booth? Who wants a phone booth? Who is that? Oh, Cammy, you're in the way. Scuba, you're in the way. This is Joe Arcade Wins. See, here's Joe. Joe is going to star with me right over here. Hey, Joe. Hey, bud. Hey. Hey, Joe. This is Joe Arcade Wins in his TARDIS booth. It's a uh, time traveling device. It is. It is from the Doctor of Who. The Doctor of Who. The Monopoly Who. Who's like who's? I don't know. You play four Monopoly tickets that you had found in Georgia and lost on all four. Well, Cubbies, have I got a story for you? If I got a story for you, you want to talk about losing lottery tickets. You want to talk about losing lottery tickets. All right, let me show you this. Hold on, let me, let me get my let me get my screen set up again over here. We're gonna take a trip over to Lottery Land. Let's take a trip over to Lottery Land. I'll see you all in a second. Okay? Okay. All right, guys, so we're over here in Lottery Land. We have this Monopoly ticket left to scratch off. This is an Australian lottery ticket. It's probably going to take me three hours to scratch off because I have no idea how to play it. But we do have that. Now, let's talk about losing lottery tickets. Let's get this one out of the way. We've got, uh, let's see, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, fourteen. 
16 20 30 dollars right there 30 dollars worth of losing lottery tickets from australia but that's okay because we have a whole lot of fun scratching them they did of course come from the psycho ducky things that i would never see before and these are really awesome souvenirs guys they really are these are cards i've never seen before and we were able to win on this ticket right here we actually sunk the destroyer for ten dollars so i'm going to send that back to the psycho ducky and uh we're going to uh send that back over there get some more australian money or uh, more australian lottery tickets uh sent back over here to scratch off on the channel veggie might that is correct so we have this ticket right here this monopoly ticket how do we play this monopoly ticket consists of three individual games monopoly game board chance and community chest monopoly game board Scratch each roll in the Your Rolls panel, rolls 1 through 15, to reveal a property name. Scratch the corresponding property on the Monopoly Game Board panel. Note, property means any street, station, utility, go, or free parking. If you reveal the required property or property as, set, as shown in the prize legend, you win the corresponding prize. Chance. Scratch the chance panel. If you receive collect, you win any dollar prize shown. You win the dollar prize shown on the card. If you win double, uh, you win double. Okay, community chest. Scratch off the community chest. If you reveal collect card, you win the dollar prize shown on that card. If you reveal triple any prize won, uh, you win triple prize that you won in the prize legend. Okay. $100,000. Australian. Alright, scratching. Bo, what's up, Bo? How's it going, Bo? How you doing, man? You least your loss relief fans from your last rap. Oh no. Oh no. I lose fans every single day. Uh, I lose fans every single day. Every time I go live. Actually. I lose about 5 to uh, 15 subscribers every time I go live. It's weird. It's very strange. But anyway guys, here we go. We have to uh, scratch off our rolls. Let's do this with uh, this one right here. Let's do it with the... Uh, with the uh, Australian nickel. Still with the Australian nickel. Let's zoom in a little bit more on the board here. Maybe, maybe about like that. All right. <sighs> here we go. Grabbing a lucky beer. Be right back. Okay. So roll number one. Roll number one is Vine Street. Roll number one is Vine Street. Where is Vine Street? Looking for Vine Street. Vine Street is right here. So we'll scratch off Vine Street. Okay, one for one, Vine Street. That's cool. Roll number two is... Coventry Street. Now where is Coventry Street? We have to find Coventry Street. Mayfair, Super Tax, Park Lane, Bond Street, Community, Regent, Piccadilly, Coventry Street. It's right here in yellow. Right here on the top of the card. All right, two for two. <clears throat> what up, BS? Thank you for the intro. I'm confused. Scratching boat. Talking about losing your money slowly, yeah. YouTube likes to kick people off some people's channels. They happen to me like three times, yeah. Three to five. Rock on. What's going on, Bo? What did I do? I'm sorry. Welcome to the channel, bro. Uh, park Lane. <clears throat> Where is Park Lane? Do we have a Park Lane? There's a... There's a Paul Mall. Bow Street. I uh, don't. Do I have a park lane? I don't think we have a park lane. If you see a park lane, let me know. Oh, the announcement that you were here. Oh, yes. Welcome in. Welcome in. Glad you're be here. What up, backseat? Oh, BS, backseat. I was thinking bullshit. I don't know. Like, welcome, welcome for the bullshit. Welcome. <laughs> Glad. <laughs> Come for the entertainment. Stay for the BS. <laughs> this will probably take me as long as to actually play Monopoly. Yep. I, I don't play Monopoly. I don't know where the streets are. Liverpool Street Station. That's going to be a train station. That's a train station. I know where they are. I know where they are. They're right here. 
All right, roll number five. Waterworks. I know where we have waterworks too. We should have waterworks. Here's the waterworks, right there, right next to Coventry Street. You like to buy one in five, but you do buy the one dollars. Yeah. <laughs> Who's this backseat gorilla bullshit? Backseat gorilla what? Ah, uh, Pentonville Road. Pentonville Road. Hmm. And I have to read all of these upside now. Here it is. Upside, upside now. Upside down. All right, there we go. Got that one. Roll number seven. Bond Street. Bond Street. Oh, Bond Street. Here's Bond Street right over here in green. Right over here in green. Okay, that's cool. I'm sorry, LOL, Sean. You're all good, man. Uh, your mom feels the same way about any of the crosswords. Uh, you love the crosswords. People love them. People hate them. Oh, you guys are awesome, though. You guys are awesome. All of you guys in the room, you guys totally rock, dude. Totally, totally rock. What we got here? What is this? Leicester Square. Leicester Square? No idea where that is. There's a road. No. 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 Fleet Street. Ah, here's Fleet Street. Is that where the Demon Barber is from? Is that where Sweeney Todd's from? Leicester Street is over here. <clears throat> All right, so we've got uh, two out of three yellows scratched off. That's pretty cool. Backseat Gorilla Productions. That's right, productions. That's right, I have productions. <laughs> productions! King's Cross Station. King's Cross Station. That's down here on the bottom. Right down here on the bottom. All right. Next we have Oxford Street. Oxford Street. Where is Oxford Street? Oxford Street is right here in the green. Right here in the green. And we've got uh, one, two, two out of three scratched off on the green. So that's pretty cool. Okay. Next up, we have. Huh? What does it say? Strand. We have strand, whatever strand is. Do we have a strand? Oh, ow! This is a microphone, jeez. Damn, microphone? Ow. Anyway, a uh, strand. Right here. Right there, I got the strand. Holy cammy! <laughs> Yeah, holiday tickets. Yep, can't wait to play the Mississippis. Yep. All right. Yeah, I need to get some more holiday tickets. I think they've all dried up around here, though. Really. All right, the Angel... Islington? The Angel Islington? I don't even know how you say that. I don't even know how you say that. But it's down here on uh, the blue squares. It's down here in the blue spots. I like that option. Okay, dokey. Okay, dokey. What's next? Mary Le Bon Station. Mary Le Bon Station. So that's this one right here. <clears throat> and we have all of the train stations except for the uh, Fine Church Street Station. I uh, see. Uh, V2 is doing okay, just taking it day by day. Um. Uh, let's see, but she's ready to come back in action. Awesome, awesome. You should send me some California Christmas tickets. Yeah, if, if anybody wants to send me tickets, um, I will be more than happy to scratch them off on camera, um, and uh, either on a on a live stream or on a li on a video. Um, my PO box is over there. Um, more than welcome any of the winnings. You know, I'll send them back to your home state. So, I'll send them back to you. I mean, obviously, I can't cash them. So.
All right, what's our next one here? North, uh, Northumber and Avenue. Northumber and Avenue. Um, okay. Marlboro. No. Ah, here it is. In the pink. <laughs> it's right over here. Right over there. Sweet. Okay, last scratchy. Last roll. Bow Street. Where is Bow Street at? Bow Street's over here in the orange. That's over there in the orange. <clears throat> hey, Gerald, what's on, man? What's up, Gerald? Glad you could be here. That's where I like to be. <laughs> California. All right, I don't think we want anything on that. We're missing the Piccadilly here. We're missing Regent Street there. We didn't get anything over here, nothing in there. Still missing one right there. Two out of three on the pink, one of the orange. Uh, a couple of the red ones there. We're still missing one train station to go to jail, to go, all that good stuff. Um, so we didn't win on that one. What's our second game? <clears throat> All right, so we, uh, we scratch chance. If I reveal the word collect, you collect the dollar prize. So we have to rat scratch off the word chance and see what we will reveal. It says, sorry, try again. Oh, well. Oh, well. And the next one, it says, better luck next time. Better luck next time. Oh, well, guys. Oh, well, cool. You keep your eye out when you go and you buy the next ticket. Well, we had fun. We scratched off that lottery ticket out of our session. We got our, our $10 Australian back. $10 Australian. Unfortunately, that one was another loser. We're going to send that back to Psycho Ducky. We're going to move our Australian five cent piece out of the way. We're going to make room for the true star of the show, Henry Vacuum and his mighty attachment. Right there, Henry Bakum and his mighty sucking attachment. Oh my goodness, cleaning up all of our little lottery messes, y'all. Cleaning up all of our little lottery messes. Because that is what good vacuums do. Uh, you were about to go live uh, and saw that I, were on, uh, I was on, but you didn't. Oh, well, I, I appreciate that, Gerald, but I am actually about to get off. Um, so if you want to go ahead and uh, set up your live stream, man, I will be more than happy to uh, raid your channel if you want to go ahead and get set up um, and go live. That would be amazing. Uh, I'm uh, just about done for the evening. We're going to step over here and uh, I'm going to uh, say some uh, closing remarks. Uh, Alrighty. Let's uh, everybody scoot back over here for just a moment. Okay, guys. So, everybody rocks. That is so, so very true. All of the pun intending. Uh, Stro says, don't go yet. You have something very important to say. All right. Uh, yeah, we're not going anywhere yet. Stro, go ahead, man. What you got? What you got? What you got? Um, I just wanted to say a few closing words over here. I wanted to thank everybody. Uh, good night, Deadpool. <laughs> good night, Deadpool. Oh, good night, Scuba Man. I know that you're leaving. I know you're leaving. Have a good night, man. Um, yeah, I just wanted to thank everybody for being here, guys. Uh, what do you guys think of the new show format? I mean, is it too raunchy for you? Is it not raunchy enough? Um, I mean, it's stuff. It's stuff that uh, I don't know. I'm happy with it. I mean, this is more. This is more my style anyway. More my style anyway. I'm probably going to make the live stream, um, I mean, I don't know. Oh, we're probably just going to leave it up, see what Google has to say about it. Shit, ass damn and fluck it. <laughs> you know what, it's Flo? You are right, man. We're here to have fun. We're here to play games on the internet. It thinks the direction you have to go just now, you can be yourself. That's right. That's right, man. You know, I was myself before, but, you know, now I can just kind of relax, take the filters off. You guys can do the same. I don't like dropping the F-bomb in here just because, I mean, you know, it does lead to a little bit of uh, partial ad revenue. Um, but, you know, whatever. It's my stream. I'm going to have fun. So, you know what? Fuck it. Let's have fun. Play games on the internet. If YouTube doesn't like it, then I'll move over to Twitch. Sorry. It's the way it is. So, guys, I hope you had a wonderful night. We're going to call it. I'll see you again tomorrow night at 8.30 Central Standard Time. You are all totally amazing. So, y'all have a good night. See you. Bye-bye.